Hello. Hello, how are you? Hi, Ivid. Hi, Carla. Hi, Gladys. Como están? Hello, Angela. Hi, Leslie. Hi, Erica. So today we're going to do some new, new nail. Um, I think I'm going to end up doing some cherry nails because I really like Mimi's nails. I don't think I'm going to paint them, but... I've been having these cherries for a good while now, and I'm like, hmm, I have been wanting some cherry nails for a good minute, but then just looking at Mimi's nails and when she got out, I'm like, oh my God, they're so cute. So I wanted to do something in that vibes, but um, with more bling, of course, you know, because I need bling a ling ling Hello, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I just didn't know if I should do red cherries or pink cherries. My husband said to do them red, but I could be a little rebel, you know? This set you have on right now. Oh, we did it a few days ago. Do you guys like it? They're fucking long as shit, huh? I already hurt one of them. Do both. No va a pinche Valentine's Day. I normally don't do red, so I was like, fine. I'll do red only because that's a very rare color for me to use, and I always want pink. Hi, San Juana. How are you? So, I think I'm going to do... um my base pink man <laughs> i always have pink fuck it huh i'm trying to decide whether i should do luscious pink as a base or um um almond butter i'm trying to do like different shit on my nose that i've never done before and like a little twist you know you know what I mean, jelly bean. Just to bring. Hey, girl, I'm waiting for my order, please. So excited. Yes, honey. Cuando lo ordenaste? Hey, girl. What grade is your sending man? This one is 150. It's perfect. Not too coarse. Not too smooth. I do have, like, pieces of gel still on my nail. Um, because I put rubber base on my natural nails. Almond butter is so cute. So I'm going to make a poll so you guys can help me choose which cherries. Okay. Shall we do red cherries? So the happy face, the red is going to be for red cherries. And the crime face is going to be pink cherries. All right. So let's see. You guys can vote down here. Right here in the little happy faces, you click one. If you want me to do the red cherries, you do the smiley face. If you want me to do the pink ones, we'll do the crime face. So you can only vote once. So let's see which cherries am I going to do. Oh my God, it's like a tie. All right, we have a few more seconds. I bet red cherries, happy face, pink cherries is the blue, the crying one. Literally, it's a gonna be a close one. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. What kind of cherries am I gonna get? Am I gonna get pink? Am I gonna get red? How come you don't tell me how many seconds are left? Red cherry, pink cherry, red cherry, pink cherry. Red. 10, 9, 8. Lock in your votes, guys. Pink or red cherries. Red is for the, the red one. Pink is for the blue ones. And... 
We're tied? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> Dude. It was a tie. We're going to have to redo this because it was a motherfucking tie, bitch. <laughs> or maybe it's a sign. Maybe I should do both, huh? Because I did happen to find one pack of mini ones. Now, nah, that's going to be look, looking a little weird. It's either one or the other. I don't want to do both. Let's do this again. Let's do this again. Meanwhile, I glue on my motherfucking tip. So, lock in your for red, happy face. For pink, the crying face. So, you can um, you can vote down here. Which are, I'm going to vote for the crying one because I want pink. So, come on, guys. Tap faster. Some people don't know how to vote. So, maybe that's why it took a little longer. Meanwhile, you guys vote. I'm going to start picking out my nails. Hi. Okay, guys. Ahora sí saben. Ahora sí saben cómo votar, ¿verdad, perras? I told you. I knew. Okay. Pink all the way. Y'all already, <laughs> you already know how to vote now. Yeah, the other day somebody's like, I don't know how to vote. Okay, so I guess pink cherries it is. What's red? What's blue? So the red would be for red cherries. The blue side is for pink cherries. We're going to do some cherry vibes with some bling. No, well, let me just throw away my red bling that I had already put to the side, honey. Because <laughs> we ain't going to need it. Okay, we getting pink cherries. Alrighty, so I'm going to have to get new bling. I already had my bling box ready for red nail, red bling. But as pink it is, you know. Pink always wins. So I guess we'll do pink on pink on pink on pink. Should I do them the whole length? Do you think I could rock this length now without getting hurt? So today I have a special discount for you guys. We are having 20% off nail tip category while the live is going on, okay? Um, nor last time I said that by mistake, like 20% off or whatever. So this time I was like, okay, well, let's do 20% off nail, 20% off nail tips. So if you guys want to shop on the website while I am live, you can use code nail tips 20 for 20% off the nail tip category only. Okay. I mean, you can still shop for other shit, but the discount is going to be in what the category of nail tips. All right, since I don't really discount the tips, I was like, all right, let's do something different. So, oh my Lord. Oh, girl, literally, I'm at that size already. Literally just the number. Fuck, should I do the whole nail? Ooh, these are cute. I'm not going to keep them forever, so fuck it. Just make them big, huh? Make them big. Make them juicy. I made myself a little cafecito already. Cafecito, cafecito. And the discount is only valid for the live. So if, if later on when I post this on YouTube, when you guys are watching it, sorry guys, it's not valid for you. Only for literally live in action video. Because my YouTube usually be like, the code doesn't work. And I'm like, no girl, it was for the live only. This uh rerun. They are actually priced very well already. Yes, I try to keep them as affordable as possible, you know. Um, but here and there, it doesn't hurt to give you guys a little discount. For those of you guys who show up to my lives, you know. Not to everybody. Not to everybody. What's the discount code? It is nail tips. Or hold on, let me check. I'm I think it's nail tip twenty. Sorry. Se me olvida. Did I put an S or not? Hold on, let me check. And then also I'm so generous. I'm gonna give you a free little nail glue for you to try it. Um uh, because it is so good, good, good. It's nail tips twenty. So, if you guys place your order, leave me a note that you want a free nail glue, one of these. 
if you haven't tried it that's a little freebie for you um because <clears throat> it is very very good very very good honey fast drying um i don't think it, it matters if it's uppercase or lowercase just let me type it in right here nail tips okay thank you raven so you could do uppercase or lowercase i don't think it's sensitive just nail tips 20 the code is only valid until the live is over so for the next three hours or so because y'all already know this bitch is slow with her nails all right so i'm not going to be doing no blending of the nail tips or anything like that i'm just going to go ahead with my nail prep and this is what i am using um i use it in the or this order so bondade first then primer nail primer this one is acid base and this one is no burn so i'm gonna leave it like that just in case you guys want to like screenshot it or something you can pin stuff now zule okay okay let me see let me see how do i do that how do i pin um hold on let me check um num, 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 num. settings comments maybe i can hold you like that I don't know how to pin comments. What's the inspo for today? We are going to do um, some cherries. Huh. Okay, spit and say, guys. Spit and say, music, stickers. Maybe we'll put text. Ah, hold on. Bitch. Oh, sorry, guys. How come I can't text? Hold on, I put a sticker. Maybe I could type in the sticker. Um, num, 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 oh, how did I do that? Interact. Randomly choose a topic to discuss. Oh shit! No, not that. Done. Oh shit, Paige, I'm not following you, girl. Okay, follow for you. Q&A. It doesn't... Um, it's just showing me random shit for the Q&A. Hold on, how do I take that off? I'm sorry, I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to pin it. She said, hold the comment. I did. Let's see. Welcome to the show, guys. Welcome to the show. Bienvenidos al club. Al club. Al club de las fans. No, it doesn't let me pin it. It just tells me to respond to her. Fuck it. Well, la que sabe, sabe. I'm going to try to... To... Ay, mention it a few times through the live, but... Hey, if you were here to hear about it, then you take advantage. Like, fuck everybody else, huh? Nah, it's good. <laughs> yeah, the pink cherries, the small cherries have been sold out for a while. I've had the cherries for uh, like two or three months or something like that. The small cherries, they sold out so fast. I just happened to find that pack in between the big cherries right now that I want to look at them. Yeah, I couldn't find it. Hi, Sylvia. The new updates don't let us pin. Oh, yeah. So right now during the live, we have 20% off the nail tip category. Um, so if you guys happen to shop right now while we're live, you can use code nail tips 20. And I believe the nail forms are in there as well. So if you guys want to try nail forms or something, now's the chance for you to try it yes it says press and hold the comment hmm because when i press and i held yours 
it said to reply to your comment. It didn't tell me. It didn't tell me pin. We are doing, what are you doing today? The peach color? No, I'm going to do cherries. Only because this is a limited time design. I'm not going to keep them for a long time. Maybe just a few days and then we'll do the other color. I don't go to the salon until Friday. So I got time to come hang out with you guys this week. Today's Monday, right? Happy Monday, everybody. Happy Monday. Yay. You said code is nail, nail tips. Nail tips 20. Which tip do I order? You can order whichever ones you want. As long as they're in category nail tips, you will get the discount with the discount code at checkout. So make sure you enter the discount code at checkout. We normally don't have discount codes, so take advantage because it doesn't happen very often. And then if you guys buy anything else, like whatever, even if you don't want to buy nail tips, you buy anything else, you can buy it. You can put that you want a free little nail glue and you get a nail glue to try out. All right, so because I am going to do pink, I decided I'm going to do Luscious Pink as a base. Mm. Should I? Or should I do Almond Butter? Hi, Zule. Why you make your life so complicated? Um, This dampen dish is on my website. It's called the Lotus Dampen Dish. Luscious Pink is one of my favorites. What's the name of the purple on your nails? Um, The purple, the solid color, it's glow purple. And the, yeah, that's the only purple one I have. And then the glitter is chameleon number eight. Can you swatch? Okay, you guys want to see to help me pick color? Okay, honey, hold on. All right, so these are the two colors I'm in between as my base. As my base color. Um, everything that I use is from my brand. Um, I'm using the dip and ombre monomer today. So this one is luscious pink. And again, with nudes or just even solid colors, I feel, depending on how thick you apply the acrylic is how deep you can achieve the color. So if you want to go lighter, just add less and encapsulate it with clear. But if you want it to be nice, and a deeper richer color and you don't have to encapsulate just um apply it to your desired thickness hi Portia girl luscious pink 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 okay pink it is pink all right yeah the almond butter is so pretty too i was gonna do that one if i did red Portia, why'd you delete instagram was that an accident or is that why you wait for your phone? All right, we're going to do pink. So I'm going to do all my nails pink, I think, because some of them are going to be Frenches and some is going to have bling. Social media break, okay. Understandable. Um, is very necessary. What size is your brush? So I'm going to be using my size 24 acrylic brush because this acrylic dries fast. And I'm trying to move faster today. Because I want to watch TV later with my son. So I'm going to do my thumb first. There's already a little glitter in there. I see you. I see you, motherfucker. Um, what tips come with a form? What do you mean? Like, pre-shape? So I'm using the square, the square tips today. Well, I've been using square, huh? I don't know what's up with me and square. Let me zoom it in a little bit. I saw you, Andrea's live. Yeah, I was cooking. At first, I was going to pick up my son. I was a passenger. I was not driving. 
Y luego me fui a la tienda. And then while I was cooking, I was on her live. I like to watch people's lives too, you know, and support. Hit the little like button, comment. Hey, Zule. Hi, Lala. I love the consistency. Your products are so smooth. Thank you, girl. Some of our acrylics do dry a little bit faster. So in the winter time, these covers are going to be your best friends. If they aren't already your best friends, they will be in the winter, I promise. Because everything that dries faster in the summer or in like normal temperatures in the cold dry at perfect speed because in the winter honey everything turns to water that's the one thing that i hate about winter is like it's so hard to do nails because everything aparte que you're freezing you're like little bitch i'm cold or whatever um and your hands hurt or at least my hands hurt when i work and i'm cold our shit be drying slow as fuck. And then we turn on the heater y andamos sudando a la verga. This brush is a size 24. Now all my pink handle brushes, they do run slightly smaller than other brands. Like if you were comparing it to another brand, um, our pink ones, they run a tad bit smaller. So maybe you're going to be like, that doesn't look like a size 24 whatever but that's what my manufacturer considers a size 24 but it is pretty goddamn big for me at least you do it so perfect it actually depends on the acrylic that i'm using to be honest because sometimes when my product is drying too fast i feel like my nails can become a little bumpy and y'all have seen it before right now my ac is on a little bit it's hot as fuck out here. This week is going to be hot, hot, hot. It's going to be up to like 105, I think, on Wednesday, bitch. I'm so grateful I have some AC, but damn, it's still hot. Um, But yeah, it's hot as fuck, bitch. So we keeping this AC on all motherfucking day. So it neutralizes the temperature, you know, like it's not too hot, but it's not cold. Like, I don't feel cold, but it's 100 in my hometown. Yeah, I was looking at at the weather today. And I was like, Lord, baby Jesus. No, my monomers are not fast dry. I have two monomers. One of them is the smooth set monomer. Another one is the dip and ombre, which is formulated for like dip powders so that it speeds up the dry time a little bit. But you can use it with acrylics as well. If you guys didn't know, dip and acrylic is the same shit. Just dip is very fine. Very, very fine. So... Okay, so I'm just going to apply my layer this thick. I'm going to come back to it in a little bit only because I don't want to get a heat spike on my nail. So if you guys ever feel heat spikes or things like that, um, it could be that you apply too thick. And when acrylic is hardening, when it's polymerizing or whatever you want to call it, it creates heat. So the thicker the nail application is, the the hotter it's going to get. So just keep that in mind when you're doing nails. If that's ever happened to you, um, that's why. So I try to put a, a layer, like a, not too thin, but thick enough. And then I come back to it once it hardened already. So I won't feel the little burn, especially right now in the summer is when you will, you're more likely to feel it because the weather outside is already hot. And so is the product, you know. Thank you for the tip. It happened to me and my client. I thought it was because her nails were thin. That could be a possibility, too, when your client's nails are thin. But more than likely, it's 
because it's polymerizing and it's hot already. The weather's hot. Plus your your nails, you know, the acrylic. So yeah. Oh yeah, the other day I did my left hand. Right now I'm doing my right hand. This one is so much easier for me to do than the other one. So I tend to change this hand uh, more often. Um, I was actually talking to one of my little nail friends. Um, telling her she could do my nails. Well, she wants to do my nails. And I was like, yes, girl, you could do my left hand. You could do my left hand. And um, we could do a live something different. This color is Luscious Pink from my website. Oh, you got it already, Portia? Yeah, Paige sent you a little gift. She bought you a brush and then I sent you a gift for your birthday, girl. I hope you like it. Paige was like, I'm going to order the brush for Portia. I'm like, oh, what a nice friend. What a nice friend. This color is fucking gorgeous. I love it. Hey, Zule. Hi, Stephanie, girlfriend. Oh, nobody ever does anything nice for you, girl. Well, it's 2022. We started a little nail tribe, a little Zule tribe. So we're here to support each other, okay? So, happy early birthday. On September 1st is Portia's birthday, right? I have a bad memory. I'm sorry. How? Hold on. Cartel, but not cartel. <laughs> yeah. That's why I'm like the tribe or I don't fucking know. We're going to name it something else. How to stop acrylic from crystallizing. Well, you need the reason why acrylic crystallizes is because your room is too cold. So, if you want it to stop from crystallizing, you either need to turn on your heater, turn the AC off, or if you have the fan on directly to your nail disc, your workstation point it somewhere else. Because normally when there's fans directed to the nail or the room is too cold, that's when that will, that will happen. I tend to put a little bit of acetone in my monomer sometimes when I want my product to dry faster. Although people have told me not to do that, but I haven't had any issues. So I do that sometimes in the winter. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, bitch. This color is so pretty, huh? So let me come back to my, to my thumb really fast and add a little bit more here. Um, I did add a little bit less. Only because I don't want it to get hot. I love it. Are you going to encapsulate the pink? No, that's why I am applying it thicker than my usual. Because I'm not going to encapsulate it. I want it to be pink, pink, pink. The pinkest, pinkest possible. So, no, hombre, ahí se me anda secando. Love you, Zelie. Thank you, girl. How is everyone doing today? So just in case you guys are new to the live, um, I do have a 20% off discount code for my nail tip section. Um, just in case y'all want to be baddies and get 3XL nail tips. And eh, just kidding. Well, whatever nail tips you want, we do have 20% off while the live is happening. You just use code 
um, nail tips 20. And it's only valid during the live, not on YouTube when you guys watch the live. So just gotta say that because I'm gonna be posting this on YouTube. Hola, Sole, ¿cómo estás? Bien, ¿y tú, amiga? And then I'm gonna just add a little strength to the nail tip. Hello, everyone. Welcome. The top, my top coat is everything. Thank you, girlfriend. If you guys haven't tried that too, girl, why, why are you sleeping on it? Someone, raise your hand if you guys got a top coat, shiny or matte on your, on your scoops. I included them on my scoops because I feel like everyone, fuck, me salió a little lumpy. Right here, I need some. That second bead fucked me up. Um... Yeah, I was like, these people need to try it if they haven't already. I'm over here trying to do this fast and it got lumpy real quick. So take your time, guys. Don't try to be a speed racer. I wanted a top coat so bad, but I didn't get one this time around. Don't worry, we'll have round two coming soon with the gels. What is crystallized acrylic? Um, it just means your acrylic is, it has like little, not crystals or bubbles, but it, I would show you, but it hasn't happened to me today. It happened to me last time a little bit because your room is cold. What? Hola, Sule, ¿cómo estás? Muy bien, ¿y tú? All right, let me move on to this one. This one just needs a little bit. Just a little bit. I'm going to go order. Okay, Debbie. Make sure. Um. Oh, maybe you were not here when I said this, huh? But... You can also get a free nail glue for the nail tips if you purchase on the live. So leave me a little note. Free nail glue. And you'll get a little nail glue sample. A little tube glue so you can test out our glue. Let's see if you lie. Most likely you're going to lie because I like. Yes, this color is luscious pink. The... The code is nail tips 20. I don't think the the what is it called? The size, the uppercase or lowercase really matter. I don't think it's case sensitive, I mean. Ah oh, shit, what the fuck did I do? Okay, la verga. I'm trying to zoom out a little bit because I keep moving. Are you going to sell your fall colors separate or just in a bundle? Um, The solid ones, those I am going to sell in a bundle until next month. Um, I'm not sure what time next month because normally I sell them like pre-sale in a bundle and then after a while I release them individually. Look, I actually have new colors too that I'm going to add that I've been having. Where the fuck did they go? Oh, where the fuck did my swatch sticks go? I just had them. Hmm. Alguien me robó. Oh, here they are. Hold on. So check it out. Look, a majority of these colors are already on the website, but look. 
So these are the new Cafecito and Chisme collection in shiny. They come in half ounce and there's eight beautiful colors for I believe 52 cookies. So you get all the colors for 52 cookies in half ounce. And then here are some of the glitter ones. Um, look, this is the new color, the Buchona. Buchona vibes. That one is golden, like pinkish. That one is falls in the air. Some of you guys got it in your scoops. And then this one's pumpkin spice. We had this one since last year. Gingerbread has also been there for a year already. Cinnamon as well. Chai spice as well. And pumpkin. Oh, no, wait. This one's yams. That one's on there too. Such beautiful gala. And these are the ones that I'm going to be adding tomorrow, most likely. I didn't get to do that today. But here are some colors. Some of you guys may have gotten them in your scoops because I did throw in new colors in there. But can you tell orange? I love fall. I love it. I love it. I love the fall, bitch. I went to Target yesterday. I went to Target yesterday. Me compré un suéter así bien caquita, brown. Like, like some of y'all will think I don't like that color. But I do. I just call it caquita brown because it's like the little caquita brown from from like the poop from the birds you know where on your website is all the fall colors um i actually posted them closer up to the home page so if you open the website they should pop out as you scroll down like on the new products I try to make it easier for you guys to find because I know not all of you guys know how to search for the items or whatever. Or maybe y'all are impatient or you're like me when I go to Target. Just go a lo que vinices, a lo que vinices. No andes buscando. Because then you end up with like 20 million items in your fucking cart. That was me yesterday. I don't really like to go to Target because I buy so much shit. The good thing is that Target is 30 miles from my house, so I don't go that often. That's the good thing. The acrylic can be shown on the front page once you go to the website. Yes, girl, I'm at school right now watching you. Shaking my head, girl. Hey, at least you're going to learn somewhere, huh? What school are you going to? Wandala, 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 Tudala, Tridala, Fo. I'm over here trying to beat these nails quickly because I know when I get to painting my little Frenchies or whatever, I'm going to lag ass. Target is the two blocks away. Ooh, girl. Oh, you walk over there? I used to live, nah, just kidding. When I used to live in my mom's house, Target was a lot closer. Then I moved a little farther. Now I live 30 miles from Target. Like, like I have a Walmart close by, but not a Target. Um, The sales for the live, it's 20% off nail tip category. So anything that's in the nail tip category, you get 20% off with code um, nail tips 20. So as long as you're in that category, whatever is in there, because I know there's other things that are not nail tips, like nail tip cutters or nail glue or nail forms or some shit, um, you can get 20% off from that category. I live right across the street from Target Home Goods. Oh, ay, lucky bitch. Lucky bitch. Lucky, 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 lucky. 
Well, in a way, it's lucky, but then at the same time, no, porque la tentación es grande. And then you probably be sleeping there, huh? I am using my 3XL square tips. This time, no le corté nada. I'm going to be brave for the next couple of, couple days because I'm going to keep it for maybe like a day or two. And then I'll do another color. And I do shave down my nails, so... Just in case y'all gonna be like, what the fuck? Are you gonna take them off again? And do -do 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 Since I'm doing, oh fuck, I fucked it up. Since I'm doing a pinkish base, maybe I could just change up the color on top or something. Just to come hang out. No, this is not gel. This is acrylic. I'm using my Kalinsky number 24 brush. Me here admiring the beautiful nails and then look at mine like I'm washing rugs. <laughs> Girl, you are funny. Get your nails did. Come on, come on, come on. Do people say you crazy because I have two different set of hands? Actually, no, they don't. I feel like everyone's used to it already or something. Not a lot of people comment on that, to be honest. In the beginning, they did, but not no more. I feel like maybe I'm not the only one. Or maybe they know I'm a nail artist. I'm a nail artist. So they're like, it's okay, she's doing it for nail content. No, these are not curved. These are straight, look at. It's a trend that people have two different s what sets. Well, if it's a trend, I'm just going to say it was me. I started it. Nah, just kidding. I've been doing this for two years now. Ever since quarantine or after quarantine during COVID is when I started to do two sets. Two different sets. I have not done a, the same shit in a long ass time. Yeah, I'm going to say I started it because I never seen other people do it. Like, but I probably didn't. But I'm just going to say I did because, bitch, I fucking did. All right. Hey, just kidding. Um, I always get two different colors. Yeah, a lot of people before back in the day. Mm, I used to get different fingers and everything. Like, I used to do different designs on every fucking nail. Like, they did not go whatsoever. And then, little by little, I was like, okay, Zule, maybe you shouldn't do that no more. Maybe you should do them a little bit different, but where they kind of match. So then that's what I started to do. And then, how to call it, I would do designs that semi-matched or whatever on both hands and then I started doing them completely different and next who knows what I'm gonna do probably the same shit on every nail just kidding I don't know I am using my luscious pink acrylic so look at you guys can see here I don't know if you can turn the camera but I applied a super thin layer of the color on my ring finger and it looks a lot lighter. It looks more like um, like a nice pale color. Um, if you guys want a lighter color, you could apply a lighter base. But if you want to intensify the color, then add more. You could do that with a lot of nudes and it's like you have two colors in one. Two color in one.
I am using my um, dip and ombre monomer. The Luscious Pink, all our cover collection, you guys can use them for dip powders as well. I forgot to mention that. Is that acrylic fast or slow sitting? This one is fast, 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 fast. Hello, Ana. Como estas, Ana? Ana Banana se fue a Tijuana. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Is that how it goes? I don't fucking remember. Ana Banana. Hola, Lina. Hola. Hola, um, Carolina. Hola. Um, do you prefer dental bibs or blue shop towel wipes? Um, I use the blue towels to wipe my nail. I'm using these little towels on the bottom. Um, I call them diapers. <laughs> I call them diapers um, because I use them underneath and they protect my table from like any chemical spillage. But I do not clean my brush on those. They are not good for that. They're just good to um, hold onto your dust, your nail tips, until you're ready to switch it out for your next client and you just throw everything away. I go back and forth from these. I didn't even remember I had this on my desk. But... Normally, I have my mat. I just put it to the side because I have to clean it. I messed it up with my painting the other day on my... What the hell was I painting? Um, I don't remember what I was painting. Oh, the stupid nail trend. Yeah, I made a hot mess on my arm. I painted my whole arm and then it got all over my mat and then it dried with the light. So I haven't cleaned it yet. And I don't want to show it because it's embarrassing. So I was like, in the meantime, let me just use my little towely, towelies over here. Dental bibs, whatever you want to call them. You could use them for whatever you want, honey. Yeah, also the Viva towels or napkins, whatever the fuck they're called. Those are great as well. I've used them before. I just, um, it's easier for me to get my hands on the blue ones because I buy them at Costco. So when I do happen to bump into the Viva ones, I buy those. I think they sell them at Walmart actually, huh? I use the blue ones to clean windows. Yeah, me too. I use them for a lot of things in my house. I started using them because of my dad. He used them for like the cars and stuff. And then I guess one day I didn't have napkin and I stole one. And then I liked it because it was super absorbent. Oh, they saw them at Target? Woo, 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 for real. I guess I never really go in the aisle at Target. I go into the home stuff, the shampoo, the makeup, the clothing, but not the like napkins and forks department. I do my own nails too, and those paper towels are fire. Best for acrylics. I only discovered the Viva ones um, because I bought them for my nail class a few months ago. Early this year, I bought them for my class. And I was like, ooh, these are good. So I will be having, I think, I don't know yet. I'm over here acting like I already have a day and shit. I'm going to be having or uh, hoping to have a nail class before the end of the year. Because, bitch, the end of the year is, like, near. What? They have them at the dollar store? What? 
I'm about to try it out. I'm so excited. I just don't want it to be too cold because then acrylic doesn't dry. Does anybody have have you guys noticed that this year the weather hasn't been too hot? Well, at least not here in California, but like is it the same in other states? Like, has it been hot as fuck out there? Or not as hot as other, like, last year? I always be messing up my second little bead on top. I'm over here trying to cover the whole nail, but a girl's not a professional at that shit. What in Riverside and it's hot? No, girl, hot. It's been hot. No, ma'am. <laughs> It's been hot and cold in Chicago. This week's gonna be like 111. Oh, it was 93 today, girl. It's been hot. <laughs> okay, well, it's because here in California, yeah, it is. It has been hot, but I feel like, well, at least me and my husband were saying that last year was hotter, hotter than this year. Like it would be above the hundreds, and. I think we jinxed ourselves because this week is going to be hot as fuck. It's going to be like 106 or something on Wednesday. I mean, I'm not trying to call the heat because I hate it, but I was just wondering. Like, are we tripping? It was 118 for real last year, right? I know I ain't tripping. It's going to be 109. Fuck that. Good thing I don't work on Sunday, but I do work on Saturday. When sudando la verga. So let me just fix this nail because I've been getting a little cocky here with my big brush. And then I can't handle it. I can't handle my big brush. Sometimes and I make a little lumpy nail. But it's okay. It's okay, honey. It's okay. We fix. We fix right now. I can't wait till the cold weather. Yeah, me neither. I'm ready to put on all these Ugg boots I got. That's what all I'm going to be wearing. But then I'm going to be complaining on the nail department. Like, fuck this cold. My acrylic doesn't dry. So my lives are going to go from three to four hours to like seven hours real quick. <laughs> I love hoodies. I love the fall. I love hoodies. I like boots. Zule, not me flying back to England after living it up in Florida heat. Oh, no, girl. You like the heat? I be dying. You need to go shoe shopping. I love the cold. I bought these stupid Ugg boots like two years ago that are like the color of my nails. I started to bedazzle them. And tell me why they don't fucking fit. <laughs> I struggle so much putting those bitches on. I think I'll have to give them away to somebody. Because my fat ass foot do not fit. Do not fit. I'm like, honey, honey. Like, what the hell? Um, The average time it takes me to do nails, normally for one hand, takes me at least three hours. One hand, bitch. One motherfucking hand. They long, 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 long. <sighs> Hold on. What? Are you going to do this hand and your one that's done? No, I just did the other hand the other day. I'm only going to do this hand. That's why I always have different hands because I do them at different times. And I want different, different videos, different pictures um because before i would catch myself that i wouldn't really take pictures of both hands so i was like girl you could be making content 
Well, ever since I started my YouTube channel, that's how I started thinking. Like, I could make content, make two, two videos instead of one. You know? Um, we're gonna do cherries. So this is my other hand. Look at. So these two have a little foil on top. I call it um, oil spill. That's what gives it that effect. Beautiful. So the foils, they come in different colors. I put a, a clear one. I put the clear one on my nail so that it didn't change the color too much. But it comes in like orange, purple, pink, baby blue. Um, magenta green. And like a dark purple. So pretty. I'm going to be putting that video up sometime this week on my YouTube channel. Humpty Dumpty sat on the wall. Humpty Dumpty had a grief. Oh. Do you guys remember that? Is that a lint on my nail? Fucking bitch. Come off. Honey, why are you there? Fuck it. We'll just encapsulate you and paint you over. No biggie, Lint. You could stay there. Free. No rent. No rent for you. My mom is a nail tick. Ooh, nice. That's cool. Do you get your nails done by your mom? Am I, like, one of the only people that, like, respond to you guys when you comment? Because I go to other people's lives, not, like, nails, but just in general on TikTok. And then I'll comment, and then they'll never respond. And I'm like, hello. Hi, you're not going to talk back to me? And sometimes I'm like, oh, my God, I feel special. They responded to me or whatever. <laughs> and I'm like, am I the only crazy bitch that responds to everyone? Oh, I try to. I'm like, yo no más quiero hacer la, la pinche chismosa hablando con todas las viejas. Um, no, my mom didn't show me how to make the tamales yet because we were out and about yesterday. Maybe this weekend. I have to take her to the store to buy the things first. Um, this color is called Luscious Pink. It's available on my website. Link is on bio. You and Lao Sad. Oh, yes. I, I was um chatting with her earlier while she was eating her quesadilla. Yeah, no, there's people that respond. But I'm just saying, like, on TikTok, I feel like some people, they, they're doing their thing. And they don't, like, respond to comments. But I feel like I want to read every comment. Okay, I kind of am not looking what I'm doing because I want to be a chismosa. So I was like, am I the only fucking chismosa here? What? Oh, what, honey? I'm answering people and they just keep asking the same question. Thank you, Paige. What are they asking? Hola, saludos. Hola, Jasmine. ¿Cómo estás? So, actually, I saw this girl. She screenshotted, um, I guess, something that she wanted to, like, for example, it would help me right now, where it would say, oh, 20% off during the live, da 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 da, -da. And she screenshotted it. She wrote it before her live. And then she inserted it above 
above, like, let's just say where my dampened dish is at or whatever. And it would stay there all during her life. I'm like, oh my God, that's so cool. That's so cool. I should try that. But I guess I moved so much. It probably wouldn't be good for me. So I was like, that's a smart idea, yo. I know. I think we only reached one million that one time and almost that second time. I'm going to be doing scoops again soon so we can reach two million or a million and a half. You think we could do that on our next scoops? I'm going to make sure to fucking drink like three monsters. Ah, just kidding. I don't want to die. <laughs> My voice is soothing. Aw, thanks, girl. Some people think I'm fucking annoying, so... Thanks. Let me clean my brush. This is the important step. Make sure that your brush is clean, clean before you put it away because you don't want any acrylic to be stuck to your bristles. So this is a sign that's clean. Nothing clumped up or anything like that. Because your brush should last you years, okay? Years, years, years. Not like a month. Unless you're new, then fuck it. You're allowed to fuck them up. <laughs> you're allowed to fuck them up, but preferably try to take care of them because it's going to be harder and harder to find Kalinsky brushes because they're starting to mix hair with another animal. So if you guys like Kalinsky brushes, you better fucking take care of them. So I'm just going to take a quick little picture. Oh, yes, honey. Ooh, hold on. Let me point them this way. And then depending on the lighting, the color changes. So always keep that in mind when you guys are buying stuff online. Or when you see a picture on a, on Instagram. Because sometimes I have clients who be like, oh, I want that color. Or whatever. Like it happened to me once with like a holographic color. Like I knew it was a silver holographic. Because I'm a pro. And eh, just kidding. Because I've been doing nails for a long motherfucking time. And I know what silver holographic looks like with fucking flesh. Alright? <laughs> so then my client was like, oh, I want that color. And then I popped out the silver holographic. And she was trying to fight me like, it's not the color. And I'm like, girl. Girl, I know what it is. Because trust me. Once I took a picture and with a flash, you're going to see the same fucking color. Um, so I was like, okay, ma'am. Hold on, where the fuck is my drill bit? So just keep that in mind. When you guys are shopping or seeing other nails, they might not look like that in real life. All right, let me switch my bit. Or like my phone be doing that a lot. Like it be catfishing. Like, it could be a light pink, and then when I took a picture, it looks like hot pink. Like, what the fuck? How? How, camera? How? So, let me switch on my bit, my standing band, because I've been using it for a while already. I use it for, like, at least a few sets on myself. Is that color good for French? Yes, ma'am. That's what I'm going to do, actually. That's why I put it on. I'm not sure if I should do pink French or white French, but it definitely looks nice with a white French. What drill are you using today? So I'm jumping back and forth between my uh, my drills. Earlier, I was using the Kara Sky one to shave down my nails, and then right now I'm using this one. I should probably use my, my Koopa one. Uh, no, para cuando me estoy volviendo adicta a tus party scoops. Um, no sé, amiga, pero en septiembre, ¿ok? Empieza a, a guardar tu billuyu. Porque esta vez vamos a tener los acrílicos del fall y del Halloween. And I was thinking, actually, that... You know, I was going to do a giveaway for the hand. I think I'm going to include the hand giveaway in the scoops you know since y'all the ones that are supporting me always like fuck these strangers that don't support rather have my one of my bitches win that fake hand you know 
En dan komen we op. Loer. Hi Tia. Hey. So I'm going to use my Manny Pro Passport actually. Change my mind. Because it's cheetalicious. So this bit is called the On Point Disc. So let me show it to you guys. Um, It comes with the bit. Which is this. And then the sanding bands come separate. But you can buy them both if you want to. And save um a few bucks. It's available on my website. Right? That's a good idea. I was thinking about it. I was like, why am I going to give it? Because sometimes complete strangers that don't even follow me or whatever. They win the, the giveaways. Which I don't mind, you know. Good for them. They're winning. But this hand, I feel like like this fucking thumb came out a little lumpy over here. Um, I feel like this hand is kind of special. So I would like one of my followers or somebody to win it. And you guys already buy my scoop, so might as well just throw it in the bin, bitch. Throw it in the bin. I'm going to buy a big ass bitch has bin, huh? So I'm going to put a como la flor in the bin this time. Again. <clears throat> yeah, it is going to go to a, a true supporter. So normally, my true supporters are the ones that are being addictas to my lives, to my story. So y'all know when the scoops come out first. So it's going to be in that first batch of scoops. The first bin because you know we go through a few bins i just bought that drone it's so good right i told you guys if you guys haven't bought your money pro passport then where you been at where you been at honey it's the best drill i've ever used and i've used a few like, the other ones that I use, they're good too, but this one's just the best of the best. And it's not sponsored or nothing. I've always bought all my drills. I've never asked no company for no free nothing. I don't like to do that. I mean, I'm not saying that's wrong because people do that a lot, but I like to... I like to share the things that I like. Whether they're free or bought. And I feel like an addict that too. Like, look, I want another color now. Like, honey, you just got that one. Relax, you little addict. Now I'm going to want to buy, actually, the not polished one when they come out with it. So I can match with my lamp. Because they gave me a lamp and I love it. I'm going to be using it today. Hi, Liz. So I'm just filing a little bit on the sides to kind of make my filing job easier in a little bit when I shapey, 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 shapey. Um, Zuley, how do you not get frustrated with those nails? I can only keep them for a week. Tops. They have a cotton candy red. Ooh, they have it already? The drill? Um, I don't know. I've been... I get frustrated with all nails. I'm used to my nails already, girl. I've been wearing them for years. But this length is definitely a new length for me. I'm still getting used to it. I'm not gonna lie. Ya me metí un putazo on this nail the other day. Quería llorar. And it was like a little putacito. This drill bit is called On Point Disc. It's available on my website. The discount code nail tips 20 is telling me it's not valid code. Um, Lucy, it's only valid for the nail tip category. If you have other things that are not nail tip related, it's not going to discount you anything. So you can still shop on the website, but that code is not going to help if you don't have nail tips in your cart. You know? For the nail tip category only. Hablas español, si sí, hablo español, amiga. 
did the code work for anybody else? Hello? Hello? All right, so today I'm gonna use my Zule 80 by 100. I have the nail tips and the forms, yes. When is Mimi going? Um, going where? Is the not polished lamp scratch resistant? I don't know. I I oh I barely opened it yesterday. Or the day before. Didn't for me because I have other stuff in my cart, I guess. No, like if you have other things in your cart, it'll still work, but it'll just deduct the nail tip category. I meant to say, like, if you're buying bling adhesive files, but nothing from the nail tip category and you enter the code, it's not going to work like that. Like, it doesn't work because you don't have anything from the nail tip category. But if you have, like, bling adhesive, monomer, and, like, nail tips, then it'll reduce from the nail tips. That's the way the codes work. So it would work for nail tips and forms or not? As long as it's in the nail tip category, because I did see, look, let me show you. Um, hold on. So when you go to products right here and you go to, where the fuck are they? Nail tips, forms, whatever is in this category is what's going to work with the, with the code. So there was nail forms right here. The, yeah, the nail forms are there. Even the debit card grabbers in there. Yeah, whatever's in this category will work with the discount. Mm, there's no space, San Juana. No space. I, I don't know why. I don't know if it's the length of my left hand, but I'm struggling to file here. <laughs> Will cheap products cause lifting? Lola, yes. Cheap products cause lifting. A lot of things can cause lifting. Mm, um, you not prepping the nails correctly or applying on the skin and things like that. I feel like I'm having a sword fight low key. Llegué tarde, pero mi emoción es muchas. Espérate, pero mi emoción es muchas verte hacer tus uñas. Yo, ah, ah yo no me, ah, uh, what? Yo no me, ah, uh, me hago por pedir. ¿Mm? ¿Qué, qué, qué, amiga, Tobar? ¿Qué dices, amiga? ¿Qué pasó? We gave this nail a motherfucking lipo, huh? Yo soy bien tonta para leer el español, eh? Perdónenme. This color is luscious pink. It's a workout to file them when they are that long. Hell yeah. It's a workout to file them. Especially because I feel like when they're after a specific length, it's hard for me to file them with an electric file because you could ruin the shape so quick, you know? Because the shaft of the file, the electric file, doesn't reach the full nail. I be sweating and filing, sweating and filing for real, man. I'm... I'm over here like sweating, filing, eating the dust, sweating, filing, eating the dust. <sighs> That's what I'm doing over here. Hold on, let me check the top.
We gotta get these nails snatched, honey. So always look down the barrel of your nail through the side. Like the side looks perfect over here to me. This side looks perfect, but when I look at it through here, it's not perfect. It's still a little um uneven towards the tip. So that's why I'm filing downwards. Hey, baby, I'm back. And yes, girlfriend, mommy, yes, girlfriend. Hey. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Portia, are you eating ice cream today, girl? Are you doing a lot of charms as well? Um, I'm going to definitely do bling charms. Only the cherry charms. I'm not sure what else I'm going to do yet. Haven't decided yet. I'm not sure why the discount code is not working for me. All I have in my cart are tips and forms. Maybe you're misspelling the, the, what is it called? The code. It's nail, nail tips two zero. Um, Elizabeth, that's the wrong code. It's nail tips with an S at the end of tips. 20, no spaces. There's no spaces in the code. Can you do other people's nails with those nails? Like length? Yes, I do actually. I work every week on clients with these jumbo nails and I... And I choopy choopy too. <laughs> Got it. I miss hear you earlier. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, I had to double check too. I was like, wait, is there an S at the end or not? Are you using your own powder? Yes, ma'am. Luscious pink, my friend. She what? Choopy choopy. You know? Choopy choopy. I'm drinking coffee, ma'am. I am going to say I am struggling to file my hand with this length on my left hand. Like, I feel like I can't hold it correctly. Because I'm a, a bump over here like... My hands are fighting like, bitch, stop it. Stop, stop. Like, relax, stupid hand. Oh, I'm about to cut one off. <sighs> but this always happens when I have a new length. So I shall. Oh, sh I shall fucking learn. I shall learn. There's a whole little skill you gotta learn, man. Hi, Abby. How are you? I'm gonna ask until you answer because I want that discount. What nail tips do you recommend for a skinny coffin? Oh, Martita, if your nails, well, no matter which length, I recommend the two XL Extreme Stilettos because once you cut them, they're like snatched. Those I recommend for skinny coffins, the Extreme Stilettos. Because even when you cut them short, they're still a nice coffin. Hey, Zule, hello. He's like on my package yesterday. Thank you. Thank you, Holly Thane, for being patient. There was a mix up with her order the other day. That's how crazy the scoops were. But damn, good thing we caught it. And thank you. I think it was Marta who had her order. Oh, 
Oh, you always on Tem Skinny Coffee and they get square. No, not with those. I promise those should not look square. I'm good at being you. Right here, getting ready for these cherry nails that are about to be Liddy McTitty. No problem, guys. We're here to serve y'all. You know what? Let me switch my fucking file. Maybe I just need a bigger file to divide me from my nail a little bit. Zule, do you do your nails every day? No, not every day. I do one hand first and the other. But this is my job to create content. So if I could do them every day, I would. Instead of going to work to the salon. I did an Ozuli product set yesterday to break in my new stuff. Ooh, okay, girl. Did you tag me though? So I could repost you. Was we'll style your inspo for the cherry nails? Um, yes, I'm, I don't know if I should attempt to draw the cherries so I can tag her. No, 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 I'm not even gonna go there. <laughs> I will probably fuck them up. I told her I was gonna recreate one of her sets. But I'm not sure if I'm ready to draw. You can do it. You can do it. Nini 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 nini. Thanks for, thanks for with what you can do it. Can you check out my cherry nails, please? You would have to um tag me, girl. Oh my god, but I don't even bathe with a nail like that. But they're so cool. Mm, okay. Okay, honey. Zuli, no me llega el momento en que te cansas de limar. Sí, amiga, en veces siento que se me va a caer el pinche brazo a la verga, pero no me puedo rajar. Antes muerte que sí, Núñez. Que sí, Núñez. Excuse me to share with us your tips and tricks. ¿Mm? What do you mean, my friend? Oh, man, I missed a lot. Hi, Martha. Don't worry, girl. We've only been applying the same color on all the nails. You have not missed much. We'll be getting to the cherries soon. I feel like these nails are long as fuck. No, this is not a pop-off pop -off set. I should have done a pop-off, but I didn't. Me creo bien chingona por eso. Hi, sunshine. How are you? Are you are you being a good girl today? Takes me a long time. Let's see how long have I been on here already. I've been on here for an hour and 20 minutes, girl. Just doing one hand. I take forever. Mm -hmm. it makes you want to do your nails do them do them do them we could do nails together <laughs> she knows me already yes honey it's me is it quicker doing clients nails yes it is it's hard to do your own nails. Especially at this length. Mm -hmm, honey. It takes a long time. Well, I'm just slow, period. People always talk shit because I'm slow, but I don't give a fuck. Not everybody's fast. So, I just learned to accept that. I'm slow at a lot of things. Like, when I cook, I feel like I'm slow. So, I'm just slow, girl. Mm -hmm. 
like that video that I made about when I did the ombre fringe. All these fucking bitches in the comments were like, it doesn't take that long. Nee, 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 nee. I'm like, bitch, it took me fucking 30 minutes, all right? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> but that video was more like to be funny. Because a lot of us don't want to do a trend, you know? Like, it's time consuming. But I'm sure the more we practice, the easier it gets. But everybody, some people were like, oh, it's not even. Or this girl was like, I am paying nobody, nobody a dollar per hour. Like, nobody asks you, lady. You probably don't even get your nose done. <clears throat> You're not slow. You just take pride in everything done right. Not an issue. Oh, thanks, Karine. Well, I guess I am slow to other people. But yeah, that shit was kind of funny. I was cracking up at the comments. I was like, damn. Like, people se pasan. Like, it's a yuck, honey. It's a yuck. Hi, Zulay. Hi, Lucia. Can you show us your nails on the other hand? Yes. Let me just finish filing this side. Are you going to tell me what chupi chupi means? Anyone going to tell me? It means we can't specify what chupi chupi means, Pedro, because we're going to get blocked. That's just a code word for, you know, chupi chupi. Saki saki long time. Girl, just get an airbrush. Everybody keeps telling me to get an airbrush, but I don't even know how to function an airbrush. Like, I did try it once, and I feel like I failed miserably at the airbrush. <laughs> but I just don't care for that design. If somebody's going to make me do it again, like, no. Or, like, I want to have to want to do it. You know? Like, I really don't care for that design. I don't want to buy an airbrush machine just for that design, either. I have to learn to do it right. Your new airbrush stickers will come in clutch for real, y'all. And only we just had that ombre French in a decal. <laughs> Have you done the nighty nails? What do you mean? The nighty nails. I used it once and I got all over my hands instead of the nails. Girl, you want me to fucking airbrush in you making a hot mess over there? Slap it right on. Mm-hmm. I have had... I have... Uh, what? Oh, you struggle with French? Me too, girl. Me too. But I've been getting better because I've been doing it more often. Oh, hell no, internet. Don't even start, yo. I saw the pigment method but i'm not sure i think it's harder to blend for me i feel like i'm not picky i'm not picky at all but but i feel like that technique needs to be blended good and with the pigments i don't think it blends very well like it bothers me to see all the streaks and i'm not picky okay but it bothers me. So I try to blend it as good as possible. So that's why I was like, bitch, it's going to take me 30 minutes because it needs to come out good. I'm not going to let my client walk out with streaks on the nail. That's not me. Like if I'm going to do that design, it's going to be done good. If not, I'm going to be stressing out. Even though the client don't really care, all she wants is the ombre, but. <sighs> oh, yeah, I did 90s nails on one of my clients a few months ago. They were blue. Chupi chupi a Siri. <laughs> This acrylic is the lush, luscious pink.
<laughs> what did you put in your comment? What did well what you did really well on that ombre now, girl. I I could have done better, I feel, but it, the black one stressed me out. I hate getting chupi chupi liquid under my nails. Se pasa, amiga. You do nails. Everybody in here does nails, huh? Raise your hand if you do nails. Put a little heart if you get your nails done. I'm tired already of filing. Who wants to file for me? These longer nails are definitely harder to file for me. More work. I got a cramp. Portia, girl, you get your nails done and you do nails. <laughs> the heart is for people who get their nails done and the raising hand is if you're a nail tech right that's what i said i said are you slow at the chupi chupi oh no not the chupi chupi girl well a little bit porque si está mejor slow and steady you know Girl, me too. I do nail. I'm leaving to be a nail tech. Oh, I'm learning to be a nail tech. Okay, honey. Good, good for you. All right. I'm done with this hand filing. My arm hurts already. I do other nails and my own. Okay. Good job. Good job. So I'm not going to file the tip until I file the top because I find that it gets round. It rounds out if I do it before. My husband's going to be like, what the fuck are you telling them? What are you telling these people? Like, ¿qué les dices a estas viejas locas? All right, so next I'm going to use my um, extra fine bit. Dude, my hand is hurting. Why are you hurting, hand? I do both, babe. Oh, fuck, it's backwards. So since I'm a lefty, I have to have my electric file um, in reverse. So let me, you're telling us choopy choopy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. El choopy, el choopy choopy. That should be my intro song. El choopy, el choopy choopy. Yeah. Hi, Stacy. Where you been, at, girl? All that work you just put in for real. But on the opposite hand, my right hand is the one that hurts. Like right here. It's like if I was fighting with that hand, but I was not. So now I'm just going to remove these little scratches. Need help renewing my license for the first time. Girl, you just have to go to the website that's on your renewal notice and pay the money and that's it. It's not hard at all. What does the L and the R stand for? For left and reverse. Oh, wait, there's no L. That's a, uh, what is it called? It's a F and a R. I'm over here like an L. The fuck? That's a controller, honey. That's like the Xbox controller. <sighs> Did you do more hours to renew the license? No, you don't. You just renew it, kind of like your normal driving driving license. Thanks, Zule. I thought I needed hours or something. No, 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 no. You don't. You just need to renew and dash it. <sighs> Zule, are you married? Yes, ma'am. I just don't have my anillo because my fingers have been getting swollen. With the calor. Como mucha... 
mucha chupi chupi. Ay, es que... <risa> Como mucha sal a la verga. Y se me hincha el dedo. But I'm gonna start working out again, so... Y'all ain't gonna recognize these sausages no more. What school did I go to? I went to, um, what is it called? The East Los Angeles Skills Center. It's in Lincoln Heights. You play all day. Hell yeah. I don't stop playing. I joke around too much. What changes did you do? Oh, que la verga. Hold on. What changes did they do after the pandemic for nail ticks? I don't know, girl. Just the barbicide thing, right? Not that I know anything different. They just made us take a test. Or not even a test, but some shit like that with the barbicide. Which was like common fucking sense. Like, if anybody didn't pass that, you guys don't pay attention. You don't read your marquita. You are a marquita. You do not read. You do not pay attention. Titi me preguntó que si yo chupi chupi. <laughs> Dude, I'm going to start singing that now. I was singing that little part the other day on Sunday. I can't even sing. I apologize if your eardrums hurt with my voice, but fuck it. That's funny. Que si le chupas al otro, el chupi chupi. Uno más a tu novia. The electric file that I'm using is Manny Pro Passport. Look at this one. All right, it doesn't have to be perfect. Ya me dio calor. Ya me dio calor. Calor. Calor a la verga. Look, right here is like, bitch, how do I hold my nail? It's too long. Oh my God. Oh my god, oh my god. Miré comentarios de que se descompone la máquina muy fácil de drill. ¿Qué opinas? Que son unas mentirosas. That's the thing that I hate about some people. Mira, mira, amiga, no vayas a creer lo que dicen, ¿eh? Ellas no dijeron que lo tumbaron. Ese es otro rollo. Yo he tenido esta máquina o yo he comprado varias máquinas. Por cambiarle la cajita, ¿verdad? Pero nunca me ha fallado. La única, la única razón por qué se me chingó es porque yo la tumbé en el piso. Porque soy pendeja. Y a mí se me cae todo. Pero de ahí no se me ha descomponido ni nada de eso. Es la mejor máquina que yo he usado, la verdad. Yo la recomiendo. My throat hurts. I should stop with the chupi chupi. <laughs> Ay, cochina. Que no andes chupi chupi el dedo del pie. <sighs> Tips for beginner nail ticks. Okay. I shall have this a uh, pre-recording message for my beginners. So beginners, you need to post all your work. Okay. If y'all... Even if you don't take clients yet, take pictures of every nail set that you do so that you can start your little portfolio. So when you do, do decide to take your clients, you already have work of yours. And take pictures of everything, not just the cute stuff or whatever you thought was perfect and whatever. Everything. These people need to see what you really do, not just the perfect. Another thing, don't try to buy the things that are 
hyped up just because you want to be a part of the club. No, ma'am, don't do that. Yeah, here and there, buy a product because you want to try it, but don't don't buy overhyped things just because you want to be cool. Because especially when you're a beginner, you're not going to make that money back fast because I did that. Trust me. I was part of the hype of the organic nails is the best. It was really good. Not going to lie. But as a beginner, I didn't make my money back with my clients. Like, if you're going to buy expensive shit, the hype stuff or whatever, the good brands, use it on yourself or on people from your family to practice, but not on your clients because you will not make that money. You won't make a profit off of it is what I'm trying to say. If it's like really expensive. I mean. Um, don't do nothing for free. Do not work for free. Once you are good. Because once you give it to them for free. They will not want to pay for it. In the future. <sighs> Zulay do you owe the IRS? Mm, not at the moment. But like why are they looking for me? I'm ah, just kidding. Um, whenever you have a business or you work in the United States, you're always going to owe the IRS. They always take your coin. But there's different ways for you to minimize your tax. Your tax due or whatever. Which is what I'm still trying to learn. Hi. Oh, that's your mom? Hola. No, estoy aquí en vivo con las viejas que les gusta el chupi chupi. <laughs> oh my god, so no chupi chupi. So can we buy your products to start with as a beginner? Um definitely. I I try to offer um great prices for beginners and professionals, so I mean, the only product on my store, I guess, that's like hella hype. Nah, just kidding. It's not hype. It's, it backs it up. It's the bling adhesive. And it's actually a really good price. I've had it for five years already or going on six, and I've never raised the price. Why did you say that I'm dead? Because she's she she thinks it's funny. <sighs> but yeah, all my products on my website are really affordable tips for teen beginner nail takes oh girl you a teenager girl well the same as a beginner practice do not compare yourself to other people unless it's going to be like in a positive way but most of the time we tend to compete with others low-key when you should not you should not compare yourself because everybody's best is different everybody um, moves at their own pace, so don't you ever try to um, compare yourself to somebody else and feel bad about it. Like, oh my god, X, Y, and Z, they started doing nails around the same time as me, and look at them. Da, da, da. That's already like bad. N that's negativity right there. No, positive vibes only. You're young. If you are in high school and you're doing nails, shit, that's good for you. That is goals, man. I mean, I started in high school too, but I didn't really take it serious. It was just a stupid class that I took. But you mature, girl. I'm proud of you. Keep it up. Practice, practice, practice. And once you turn 18, you can go get your test, your license, do nail for a living. And another thing is don't think you the shit either in general. Like, I hate when people think they're so good at doing nails that they can't even talk to you. Like, bitch, humble your ass down before I humble your ass. Like, relax. Relax, bitch. You you started somewhere, too. Have you ever tried Beatles nail polish? No. I don't really try other brands anymore because I already have a bunch of product. But just in general, gel polish is something that I've never really used before. I recently started to use it um, because of my sister. This bitch 
loves to do her manicures and all that bullshit. So I ended up getting jail because of her. And then I'm grateful that I did because now jail is becoming popular again. Like, bitch, I could barely paint a normal nail. You want me to paint you a reverse ombre in a French? But you know what? Practice, practice. I be. It sounds like I be complaining all the time, which I am a little bit, but only because I suck at it, okay? The more you practice that stuff, the better you're going to get. So that's why I always, I don't know if you guys have been watching me for a while or not, but for those of you guys who continue to come to my lives all the time, you guys know that my my Frenchies have been weak as fuck, but they getting, they getting better because I keep pushing myself to do them. So I'm going to file the tip now because they're a little crooked. Um, I've been pushing myself to do the things that I struggle with. So a lot of us, we always focus on our strengths, right? It's actually important for you to at least be good at one thing or whatever. Like figure out what you're good at and make sure that you're really good. You're proficient, you know? And then once you're good and you mastered it, then go to focus on one of your weaknesses. So for me, it's drawing. Like, I'm really good at flowers. I'm really good at bling and all that bullshit. So now that I'm really good at that, let me focus on something that I ain't good at, which is fucking painting. Anything with gel, I suck at. So that's what I've been trying lately. Can't take that little piece off. I'll buff it off. I just ordered that disc. Yes, honey. Yes. So if you guys suck at choopy choopy, you need to practice. <laughs> That's the only way. Is it the same practice in a real hand? Then No, it's not. I ain't even going to lie to you. It's not the same practice. But fuck it. Some practice is better than no practice. All right, hold on. Let me actually instead of filing the other way, I need to file like this always because my fingers are crooked as fuck. So just a little tip also for you beginners when you're filing or sticking nail tips on gl glue them this way, especially if your client or your customer has crooked fingers. That way, this is their view, um, because if you try to file this way, or put on the nails this way, it's at your view. It will look crooked this way. If you glue them this way. If that makes sense. And sometimes when you turn the hand around like this, you'll be like, oh, it's a little crooked, but it's not. Tips for pricing. Um, I always recommend for you to, especially if you're a beginner, to go to nail shops in your area and compare. Compare your prices. Every state varies from city to state. So don't compare your prices to other nail techs in other states from you because everywhere is different. Also, your skill levels are different. So if you see somebody charging an arm and a leg and you're only charging like 10 cookies or whatever and you're like, what the fuck? I'm undercharging myself. Well, maybe you should raise your price. But obviously you can't charge no 500 cookies like the other person because some places they won't pay for it, you know. But you never know until you try. And of course your price needs to match the skill. I'm by Top Line in LA and they charge a lot. Oh, yeah. I heard they are pricey. I feel like my prices are extremely low compared to other people. But I just do nails for fun now. Like, I get paid for them. But I, I can, how to call it? 10 cookies, yeah. 
Like, it's for fun, but not for fun. Like, I still get paid for it to pay my rent at the salon, but... Here and there, I'll get a, a, a cool client that will let me freestyle. And then my nails are for fun. That's why I always be changing them. Tips para cobrar el Chuaroski. Mm, pues tip para cobrar lo que sea es tú le quieres ganar para comp pa comprártelo de nuevo. So she's asking me tips on charging Swarovski. Um, but this goes for anything, anything, whatever you buy, you have to at least double it or triple it, depending on how much it costs. So let's just say, si una piedra te cuesta un dólar, tú tienes que ganarle un dólar o dos dólares para comprarte, para reemplazar tu piedra y por tu tiempo que la estás pegando. So, tú puedes cobrarla como, por ejemplo, toda una uña completa. Puedes decir, ok, pues yo la voy a cobrar a ocho porque cuatro dólares, cuatro dólares me toma para comprar el producto y luego duró diez minutos, quince minutos en pegarlas. So, entonces, ese va a ser tu ganancia. So, lo que tú quieras, mija. No te puedo decir con cuánto cobrar, pero es un ejemplo. Damn, my internet is lagging, huh? Is it lagging for you guys? Or is it just my other phone? Oh, shit. No, okay. My phone over here is lagging. Yes, we're going to do cherries today. The liquor for the acrylic I have dried up overnight. In your jar? If you left it in if you left it in your container, of course it dried up. It evaporates. You need to cover it or actually you're not even supposed to reuse it. Zule, buy us food, be a good girl. Te mando de la comida que hice. No, in the bottle. Did you leave it open? It should not have dried up overnight. Unless you left it a little open. Um, Would you recommend to practice for tips? I model a model fee. I have no, no license though. Wait to get license. Um, yeah, you can. You, I think um, getting accepting tips is fine in the beginning if you don't have a license and you're just practicing for fun. I mean, just know that if you leave it up to them to tip you, they're not most likely. But it's okay because um, practicing on a fake hand is not is not the same as a real person. Just take it like an internship. Like I was talking about this last time. Um, take it like an internship. You're going to work for free for a little bit until you get good, you know, until you get good, until you get better. Then you can start charging, you know, because I feel like a lot of us, <clears throat> a lot of us, we get discouraged as beginners because we don't get paid. But then what about when you're a dental assistant or a, mm, I don't fucking know what else they intern for like oh you're gonna intern for this x amount without pay and you're fine with it i mean some of us complain or whatever but for the most part you're used to it it's like you know it's a part of your your career that you have to give up because it's training you're getting paid with knowledge pretty much so when you are self-employed it's the same thing pretty much you're learning life experiences you're learning what to do, what not to do with your clients. So you're not going to get paid. And that's okay. But when you get good, girl, then that's when you're going to get paid. So don't get frustrated. Don't be like fucking trying to charge everybody an arm and a leg. Because then you're not going to have clients. Porque así me pasó a mí que I got desperate. And I was like, yo voy a cobrar 50 dólares. Nada menos. And 50, 50 cookies was a lot back then. Y 
you know what happened? I didn't have no clients. <clears throat> so then that's when um I had to go look to the nail shop. How much they charge? How much they charge over there? Okay, that's how much I was charging. I was like, okay, 12 cookies. I actually was looking at my old calendar. Bitch, I used to, I was telling one of my clients because she was trying to find out. Um, She was trying to find out how long she's been my client for. And I told her, I'm like, I have my old calendar. I'm going to go look. She's been my client for eight years on October. It's going to be eight years. Hold on. I'm going to file this one a little bit more on the side. And I looked at her first set. I charged her 20 cookies for her nails. I used to make a hundred and something dollar cookies a week. And she's like, girl, how did you survive? I'm like, I don't know, honey. I used to make very little money. I mean, obviously, minimum wage has increased a lot like it doubled in shit since then so if you're a beginner you better not be charging 20 cookie shit minimum 40 cookies but that's the bad thing about having long-term clients too is that you're stuck it's hard for you to up up the price on your long-term clients okay now it's 50 cookies a day now it's a one fifty cookies a day, for yes, for some people it's one fifty cookies a day or more. Minimum. All right, let's see what color should I do? What color? What color? What color? Let me pop out my gels real quick. Should I be a normal bitch and do them white? So my cherries can pop. My cherries. Oh shit, oh shit. I think I am. All right, I've, I've never done this on myself actually. So I'm kind of excited to be a normal bitch. All right, so I'm going to get my little palette out. Let me get another diaper to put on my on my full desk actually. Can't wait to see me. I'm excited because you already know Zule is a queen of Frenchies. I just kidding, bitch. Hold on. I'm going to use a liner, 25 mm. So I'm going to be using my liner brush, the pink one, and 25 mm. And am I supposed to be nervous to do people's nails? Um, It's normal. Everybody gets nervous. So if you're not nervous, she, you a, you a fucking bad bitch. There's people who do not get nervous to do other people's nails, but it's totally normal to get nervous. So I have gel from last time when I was using this. I normally don't clean the brush until I'm going to reuse it again because they have they have lids. So my liner brushes, the pink ones, this have a little lid to protect the brush. Girl, I can't find a job in a clean salon and I can't find clients. Girl, keep looking. Keep looking. It's hard to find clients. People think it's easy, but it's not. But it's not impossible either. You just have to be patient. Así como buscar novio también es hard. Be patient, guys. Be patient. You will find them. Okay, are you going to make the cherries from the stuff you made the pizza? <laughs> no, I have charms. I have pink charms. Look at it. You guys want me to start cooking or what? All right, so we are going to use the No Wipe Painting Gel in white. We're 
we are going to just dip the brush in there. Take some out. So the painting gel is a little bit thicker than your normal gel. Right now that it's hot, it thins out. But in the wintertime, it will... Ooh, it will feel thicker. So I'm just going to mix it a little bit with my regular white gel polish. Just to thin it down a little bit. And the reason why I'm using the white one versus regular clear. Because I don't want to... I want to still have it white. Okay. Just in case somebody's going to be like, well, just put clear. Like, no, girl. You do not want to put clear on it. No, no, no. Alrighty, so let me get my other brush, my gel brush, my other one. This one is my handy dandy best friend. We ready to start painting. Raise your hand if you're ready to hold your breath with me. How do you take the color acrylic out of the client that wants no color or when is gel? Um, you have to shave it off if it's color acrylic. Okay, let's get started. Oh, shit, I got alcohol in my nail. Okay, so I'm thinking I'm going to do three of them Frenchies and then the other ones, I don't know. So I'm going to start with the thumb. A ver, persínense en el nombre del Padre, del Hijo, del Espíritu Santo. Amen. All right. So this is the way I start with the Frenchies. I start on the side now. This is just the method that works with me. I've tried a few different ways. But this is just the, the way I prefer now. I feel like it's easier for me now. God damn, this is a big nail. That's why I decided to use my size 25 mm because bitch is like girl, you're never gonna be done. Never ever ever. Alright, so we're gonna go deep. How deep would you like it, client? This one is 25 mm. Client, how deep would you like your French? We kinda of wanna go deep. Should we do it kind of deep? For this nail size, I think this is good enough. So I always recommend me a French professional now. Um, go a little lower than what you really want. Because once you start painting like the line, the French, you're going to be fixing it and shit. And then it's going to go up a little bit more. Deep, deep. You like it deep, huh? Me too. Deep French gang. And then like how pointy you want it. You want it pointy? You want it round? I think I already fucked up. I put it two to the side. Okay, Zule, move your arm correctly. Sorry. Alrighty. Okay, honey. Let's see. Dang, this is gonna be harder than I thought. Now I'm just gonna paint. I'm gonna fill it in and then I'll fix it as I go. Frenchies and I are not friends. <laughs> I'm trying to make them my friends. They're gonna be my bitches. She... I'm not very good at Frenchies, but we getting better. We getting better. It's like, that's what I'm going to be doing now from now on. Frenchies only. They You make good money off of Frenchies. She. Even though they're boring and shit, but they money makers. Let me just say that. Small French, 80 cookies, 80 cookies and up. So I did not file my nail pretty good, but it's okay. 
we putting a cherry there. Let's tap like our life depends on these likes are weak for real. But it's okay. We haven't. You guys can start tapping right now that we're painting. Hmm. Portia's the queen of Frenchies. The queen. The queen. Oh my god. I think I made it a little too pointy. Let me try to fix this. Hmm. I hope my tech doesn't hate me, pues. No, she's not going to hate you. She not gonna hate you. Why she gonna hate you? Cause you want French? I'm I feel shaky now. Stop shaking, Lule. Stop shaking. Um should I make it more round than than yeah, I think I am. I'm gonna bring it up a little bit. So this is why I said go lower than you think, because I think I'm gonna make it a little bit rounder than pointy. Dude, this coffee got me shaking. <sighs> no, leave it pointy. Oh, you you like it? Oh, okay. Well, well, well. Hold on. I didn't take away a lot. I was planning to pop on my brush to clean it, but I guess you guys like it pointy. So let me try to fix it here then. Oh shit! I touched it. I am going to say this is harder with both hands too long. I said it. They're too long for me. <sighs> okay. Oh, my God. All right, I'm going to cure this bitch in my new lamp. Let me move this out the way. In my new cherry lamp. We're going to do it for 60 seconds real quick. Let me drink some cafecito. <clears throat> I wait. I almost choked on my cafecito. That lamp is so freaking cute. It's cute. Huh? I love regular French outline and V French. I think I prefer the V French. I feel like the V French is easier for me. But I'm going to make the U French my bitch. Oh shit. I just touched the fucking lamp. Did you like the not polish acrylic? I did actually. I tried the yellow one. The yellow one they gave me. I haven't tried them all yet. I know I've been liking it, but I've been really tired lately and kind of busy. So I tried one of them without recording because I was desperate to try it. Not desperate, but like, you know, like I was anxious. Like, oh my God, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. And excuse me. It was a really pretty color. It's from the o OMG collection, I think. So pretty, smooth. I like, I like. I was telling my live the other day that I think I'm going to just cancel my brand and be a brand ambassador for them. <laughs> okay, next. Be like, you know what? Let me just be a brand ambassador for you. Fuck Lulay's nails. I'm retired. Alrighty. But it was a joke. I'm just kidding. Alright, so next I'm gonna do the middle finger. <clears throat> Don't be joking like that. I know, I know, I know. It's a joke, it's a, it's a joke. Let's see which French comes off for better. Normally, the last one is the one, like the first one is the one you fuck up, right? 
And then you get better and better as you start painting and painting. And then I'm like, how many inches away did I do this one? A little bit of mannequin. Yeah, I think that should be good enough. We like it deep, deep, deep. Deep, deep. All right, full concentration. Hold on, let me zoom out a little bit. Next, stop breathing. This is the only time that I'm going to be quiet because I'm painting, trying to do it right. Everyone's probably like, is my mic on? I can't hear anything. <sighs> like, I can't hear anything. Is really talking? Like, no, she was focused in her little French. Oh, fuck, did I fuck it up? Do not fuck it up. Like Zuzu, are you alive? Yes, we are alive and painting. These low key remind me of my Hello Kitty nails. I did white French now that I'm thinking about it. <clears throat> Do you think charging 30 cookies get me far? Are you a beginner? I mean, if you're fast, shit, that's still good. Like, I feel like there's people who charge low. Like, um, I, I don't remember her name. Well, I'm just not going to say no names, right? So this girl, but she fast as fuck. Like, she could bring you a she could give you a full set bedazzle and all of that in an hour so if even if she were to charge or like if you're fast 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 and you charge a 100 cookies for like a bunch of shit you still making money because that's per hour you know but if you slow as fuck like zule then 30 cookies is not gonna get you that far girl especially if you take a long time but again, it depends. Depends. Let me rephrase that, actually, because um, back in the day, our minimum wage was eight cookies an hour, and I would make about that much per set. So if I was taking two to three hours, I was still making minimum wage. So it's I. Like, so just kidding. Depending on where you live. How do you, how long did it take you to get good at nails? It took me a long time, girl. It took me a long time because I didn't have any teachers. I don't have nobody to teach me. I had to learn on my own for the most part. Like my tutorials that I would watch were the ones on a fucking magazine, bitch. When I started doing nails, it was tutorials on a motherfucking magazine the ones that i would look at like how are you gonna learn off a magazine i mean we did learn off a magazine but let me just tell you that was the way we got design exposed through a motherfucking magazine so all you fucking little bitches on tiktok Instagram that are new, you all got no excuses, none. Y'all have it all. 
And not just nail ticks in general. You want to be a makeup artist? You want to make fucking cakes? You want to be a whatever? You can even become a doctor through YouTube and shit. I'm just kidding. Well, kidding, not kidding, but you guys get it. You can learn how to do so much shit now. No excuses. And if you have an excuse, then you really don't want to do it. Mm -hmm. You could be a doctor, Loki. Watching Grey's Anatomy, she... So Lake I'm to be a doctor. Hell no, I don't wanna be no doctor. That's boring. Nah, just kidding. That's probably kinda cool, huh? Being a doctor. I could never. I'm too I'm too unprofessional for that. How long did you practice before you started taking clients? That's a very good question because I never thought I would be doing this on real people. I went to school for my license just to have a certificate or a license for backup. But I never thought I would be doing it on people until after I got my license is when I decided to, um, how do you call it? I started to take clients but that took me a long time because i went to school only once a week i will go to my nail class on saturdays when i could make it because i used to go to college and i used to work full time so it took me a long time to get my license all righty so i'm gonna do the pinky one too I practice until I felt confident in my work. Yes. And even I feel too that you're not going to get better until you become full time. Like you're not going to see the big difference until you become full time. That's when I noticed my, my work got better. Because if you only do it once every couple weeks or once a week or whatever, um, you're not getting enough practice in. Like you think you are, but that's not enough to perfect your skill. And that's when you start getting faster. You learn a new technique. <clears throat> How did you get your speed up? I would be lying if I said I did. I think I got slower. Because I see... I see my calendars from back in the day. And I used to do appointments... In two hours. Two hours. Now I leave a three hour gap with all my clients. But that's because I didn't know how to do shit before. Like I would just do one color and accent nail. Now you, there's so much that my clients ask for sometimes. Like time consuming shit. Like we, back in the day, French, you did not hand paint it. You just put a stupid white tip and boom, you're done. There was no full bling nails. Well, there was, but I don't know how to do them. Fuck, I can't do my pinky. Ah. Hold on, let me let me turn my hand. I didn't really know how to do anything when I was a beginner. I didn't know how to do flowers. I didn't know how to... Actually... People did get bling, but they were afraid to get it because their shit would always fall off. And they would be like, ay, no me gusta ponerme eso porque se me cae, nunca me dura. And then they'll be like, cuando voy con los chinitos, siempre se me cae. So it was really hard for me to convince people to try nail art bling anything because they would have bad experiences other places and then they would just assume in general it didn't it was not gonna last anywhere patience 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 mm-hmm 
Yep, yep, yeah. Patience is key. Fuck, me anda tronando la pinche tripa, no mames. I think I'm going to have to fucking run to the restroom. Me voy a cagar a la verga. All right, let me fix this French because this one got out of control real quick. Fucking pinky, I swear. No mames, we. Oh. Saw your toilet, though. <laughs> I've been practicing patience since I was 13 and started doing my own hair. Because, child. <laughs> 13, girl. Damn it. Damn it. Why is everything harder on the damn pinky? Why? Fuck it. We're just gonna leave it like that. No, 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 no. Fuck. My stomach fucking hurts, guys. No voy a cagar. I read child como chile. <laughs> My sister did that once too. I started fucking laughing. Somebody commented that once and she's like, Chile. And I started laughing because I already knew what they meant. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. No voy a cagar. No voy a cagar a la verga. Let me dry my nail. I'm going to run to the restroom. I'm doing my hair right now. I've been doing it since 9 a.m. What are you doing to your hair, Portia? I need to see this hair. As a matter of fact, I need to see a full nail. I mean, a full nail fee. A selfie up close and personal because, girl, I can only see your, your face in that little picture. You never posted a picture of yourself. Huh, on Instagram? On and off on my last little block. I'm doing butterfly locks. Ooh, that sounds cute. Fucking bitch. So I'm gonna have to get off this live so I can go poop. Porque no mames me voy a cagar. And then I'll come back. Me want to put my phone to charge. Come on. I'm dead. Okay. I'm swatching all my acrylics I ordered from you. And I hate swatches now. <laughs> Why? You got a lot of them? You got a lot, a lot? Zule, I need you in my life. Always making me laugh. <sighs> all right, guys. Um, I'll come back right now. Let me go to the restroom. Fucking bitch. I mean... I'll be back, okay? It trend nail that oh my god, girl. I'm a okay, then it's busting, busting, busting. Hello. Dude, casi me muero. <laughs> yes, Marta, I feel better. Ya mi tripa me andaba, no manches. 
I was messaging Sylvia on Instagram while I was in the restroom. I was like, girl, I'm in the toilet. I've been getting distracted on Instagram. Guys, don't take your phone. Don't take your phone to the restroom. You're never going to come out. I had to go to the restroom. I had to go to a restroom and then I was um, on Instagram responding to my messages. <laughs> and then, you know, time goes by and you're just sitting there. And I was like, oops, I need to go back. That's why I deleted Instagram for real, man. It's like I need to respond to my bitches. I need to respond to my messages because I get so many messages. Like... A lot of my my followers, y'all be responding to my stories like crazy. But it's like, where you at in my comments, huh? <laughs> and so I'm over here trying to respond to everybody's messages sometimes. And I just can't. I have too many. Um, I'm doing cherry nails. So I'm going to do French. I'm doing French on a few nails. And then I'm going to add some cherries and some bling. I just had to take a little break to go to restroom because my stomach was hurting. One of these days, I'm going to learn the difference. What do you mean, San Juana? The difference between what? How do you keep it from looking streaky? I act you just have to put layers. I mine is a little streaky. I don't know if you can see it, but after I washed my hands, it kind of showed me my streaks. I was like, oops. Oh stories. From the stories, the difference. Um so what I mean by that is that whenever I post a story, I feel like more people interact with it and are more likely to comment on the post, on the story, than a regular post. Like people look more on the regular posts and don't comment versus my stories. More people are in my DMs talking, conversating with me. I mean, I don't mind it, but, like, show me some love in my comment section, too. Hello. So, I definitely am missing a piece there. It's it's okay. We're going to fill that up later. I'm nowhere near perfect, guys. I be fucking shit up, too. Um, Zule, love your work. My sister's name is Zule. Ooh, she my tokaya. So it's okay to not be perfect, guys. I'm not perfect at all. No, 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 no. Comments on Instagram. On Instagram. And I feel like not a lot of people comment. So I, I just learned to understand people look hi shut up on my for you page hey when you when we doing more 3d food um maybe sometime this week we could do some more do you guys like this ham better or my french my normal hand right now oh my god is the latina on brand yes ma'am girl no soy bajada del cerro, pero mis papás sí. <laughs> I'm like, yo no, pero mi, mis papás sí. All right, let me. Oh, shit. Saca el dedo antes. Where we at? I'm just putting a second coat on my nails. 
I'm gonna show my lamps and my pago. Purple nails. I try to comment whatever I see. Oh, thank you, San Juan. I do see you showing love all the time. What's a good wattage for a UV lamp? Um, I recommend you switch over to a, a LED lamp. No more UV. At least 36 watts. I really like my lamp. I like the fact that it doesn't make noises. It doesn't make noises when I stick in my, my finger. I hate that shit. I would hate when it would go like beep, beep, and it's like, bitch, shut up, stop running on me that I'm moving. I mean, I guess in a way that's good to notify the nail tech that the client moved. But after a while, it'll be getting annoying. I'm going to put my finger on here. Why do people prefer LED? Because it's faster drying than UV. Nobody really uses UV lamps anymore. You should make the switch. I love the purple one because purple is my favorite color. I do like the purple too. I feel like my favorite are the purple is the chameleon. The chameleon effect. What brush is that? This is my gel brush. Look, it's a Picasso brush. Um, it's part of my four piece brush set. I love it because it's easy to like fill in the ah oh, fuck. The 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 the, the, the white. So I'm just going to use this other brush. This is also part of the brush set. I use this one normally to clean. To clean the nail when I'm doing like a little French. Or anything because it's like small. Fuck, something went into my eye. Last time I got alcohol in my eye, that shit hurt. Like, literally, I pumped it into my eye. I'm like, oh, ah, it hurts. So, this French, I think. I'm going to make it a little bit more round here. Because I think I didn't paint it right. Yeah, I was pumping the, the alcohol last time. And it went straight in the eye. That shit hurt so bad. I was like, I'm going to take my makeup off because it hurts. But I always get eyeliner in my eyes, so I should be used to it. I should be, but I'm not. How do you clean your brush with gel polish? I use clear gel to remove the color, or I use acetone or or alcohol. I wish I could do French like that. That's perfect. No, girl, it's nowhere near perfect. Trust me. But with practice, you do get better because... Um, I have not really been good at it either, but lately I have been doing it more and more and more. So um, they're definitely getting a little easier, but you just have to, um, get the hang of it. Is it off? Yeah, hold on. Let me just cure my nails. I guess the, I, I can't tell when that thing's off. So I'm going to be adding some cherries in a little bit. I don't know if I should add... 
pink. Yeah, I am gonna add pink bling to the other ones. Ding 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 ding. Ding 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 ding. ding. Yeah, oh shit. Sorry, let me unplug my charger. So they are definitely not perfect, but they're getting there. They're getting there. Hi! Ah, just kidding. Did I scare you? <laughs> like wake up bitches wake up why don't you put a little makeup i don't know what the fuck else it says <laughs> did somebody ask me I'm gonna put bling. Of course I am, honey. Of course. Just because we're going a little classy today don't mean we ain't gonna have no bling. We have to have bling. And if, if not, then something was wrong with me, honey. I wanna put music so bad. <sighs> But I don't, I'm not going to because then I can put it on YouTube. Jingle bell, jingle bell. Are you able to buy your full gel polish and acrylic collections all in one? Um, We don't have that as an option. Like, um, I mean, you can add them both to your cart, but as a one transaction, like one item vibes, no. But if you're interested, I can um, help you with that. They definitely knew Zule is a queen of bling. Mm -hmm. The Mexican queen of bling. Nah, just kidding. There's other people who... Are competing with me with the queen of bling so we're, i'm a princess we're princesses why didn't you use white acrylic because it's harder for me to do french i think it's harder to do french with acrylic um what's hard either way but i feel like it's easier to fix it with gel and I didn't know how many fingers I was gonna do to be honest all right stick it in the lamp Zule. stick it in the lamp Loki I wish all the collection had the option to buy as a set like the the acrylic or the the gel I think we had we had the gel polish I don't I think it's in there or maybe not the gel collection I don't remember so the in the beginning we do have it as a collection so when we first released our acrylics two years ago all the colors all 88 colors because back then we started with 88 colors I had them as a full collection but after a while they start selling out certain colors so faster than others because of course of the shade so we can all we set aside a certain amount of collections like let's just say i don't know like a percentage like let's just say 50 or 20 or 10 or whatever to the side to sell as collections and the rest will be sold individually you know because not everybody could afford the collection so after that the colors are not all available anymore and some just don't get restocked because they're not as popular or because of the seasons or whatever. So that's why later on I can't offer them as a collection anymore because there's missing colors. So that's why I came up with the 50, no, 45 colors. That way I'll just pick 45 colors 
because we have more than 45 but they're not a specific color if i buy the full collection will it be glitters and solids so there's two options so if you choose the option of solids then you're only going to get solids if you choose the glitter one then you get all glitters so i think i'm gonna add should i add one more coat or should i just leave it like that I think I need one more coat. <laughs> Should I add a one more coat, honey? One more coat. Okay, yeah, me too. I know. I think it just needs it towards the tips. Yeah, so hopefully that makes sense as to why we don't have the full collection because we don't have all the colors anymore. And then I keep adding more colors over time. But when the colors are new, most of the time they're in a collection. And after that, they're no longer in a collection. Hi, Sandy. ¿Cómo estás, Sandy? ¿Cómo estás, amiguis? Hello, Eloisa, Eloisa. ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás, amiga? Are you doing a new bling box soon? Oh, yes. My mom's working on that right now. So it's going to have, I think I showed it to you guys on Instagram. It's going to have different shapes from before. And three of our new crystals, which are these, the ones that I have here on this finger. Wait. Yeah, the little, they're like jelly. They're so pretty and sparkly in person. So it's blue and pink. They come in two different shapes, I think, or three. Um, and I'm thinking of adding the chaton one too. Remember I was showing it to you guys, the new crystals that I have? But I don't know if I have enough chatons. Chaton is. Loving the Spanglish, yes. It comes off, it comes out automatically. I don't have an on or off switch. It just happens. All right, I think that's enough. Enough gel. Okay, stick it in the lamzule, stick it in all the way. Um, I'm new here. Do you have a fall acrylic bundle? Yes, we do, Noemi. We have a solid color, actually. It's called a cafecito. Cafecito and Chisme Collection. And then we have our glitter acrylics, the fall ones, all in the same the same picture. That one is not sold in a bundle. But I'm considering adding as a bundle again. Only because somebody asked me earlier today. But my husband hates when I do bundles because sometimes an acrylic is not made. And then he's like, can you make this acrylic? And I'm like, I'm busy. Oh, my God. You said my name right. No one ever says it right. No, Emmy. No, Emmy. No, Emmy. All right, let me close my shit. Let me put away my... Oh, no, 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 no. I still need this. I still need this. I still need it. All right, so I have decided I'm going to make little white strips on my ring finger. Oh. 
Let me do. I have so many glitters. Oh my gosh. It's hard hard to pick which ones to put. All right. Hold on, guys. So I'm going to do a crisscross on here. So I could put some cherries. Crisscross applesauce. I just thought of this right now. Mm -mm -mm. Oh damn, my hand's shaking. My hand is shaking, shaking, shaking. Too much coffee today. Maybe I should put it here. Another Blink Princess has cherries right now. Ooh, really? Mimi is making it a thing. That's why. Nope, this is not going to work out. This is not going to work out, Zule. Just freestyle it. What bling am I going to use? Um, I don't know. What I want to use pink for sure. These lines are definitely not coming out crisp. But fuck it, thug life. Um, pink and maybe some gold, the light gold. I don't know. Because that matches the cherries. Um, yeah, I'm going to do some Halloween nails. I don't do nothing too crazy Halloween. I'm not really a big fan of Halloween, but I'll try. I'll try to do some Halloween nails coming soon because September's already starting, huh? Hold on. I'm going to redo this. My lines could be better. I'm just overthinking this. Hold on. I want them to be thinner is what I want. Okay, Zule, just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Do it. Do it. Don't think about it. It's so hard to do it on my, on my hand. Estoy toda chueca la verga aquí. I wish I could put this on my TV. Well, when I upload it to my... When I upload it to my YouTube channel, you could. You could put it on your computer, actually, on TikTok. Or put your phone to mirror your phone. I mean, put your TV to mirror your phone or some shit. You know, it has that option to put on your TV, the smart thingy. And whatever's on your screen will go onto your TV. Okay, that came out better. I just have to do it fast, like whip it. Whip it fast. Whip, 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 whip. All right, this time I'm going to start from the bottom. Sorry, honey. Sorry. Oh my god, so smart. Thank you. You're welcome. There's gonna be five cookies. Five cookies, amiga. Just kidding. That's what I do sometimes. I um put my phone to my TV. Damn, I was doing so good. I fucked up already. 
It's okay. We're going to put a cherry right there. We're going to put a little cherry. Technically crazy. Wait. So watching your live, I can airplay it on my TV? I think so. Try it and let me know if you could do it. I'm sure it's possible. I've never tried a TikTok live, but I'm sure you can do it. So my lines ain't the best, but that's as good as it's going to get. Zule, I'm going to send you a selfie and my hair. Ooh, okay, honey. I want me Portia up close. Like, actually, not just Portia, but if you one of my bitches, you better send me a selfie. Because... I need to know what you guys look like. That's going to be a thing. Tomorrow, everyone's going to post a selfie of themselves on their page. Because we need to meet the nail artist. We need to meet that nail artist behind all that that um talent shit. People need to know who, who it is that's doing those beautiful nails. We should do that a do a monthly picture. You know what I look like. I sure do, Sylvia. Sylvia actually always be posting selfies with those big beautiful lashes. So everybody else needs to do the same because I wanna know. I'm on stories all day. Oh yeah, Stephanie too. Like those of you guys who don't be posting your face, why not, honey? Why not? Who cares if the peinaste or no? It's like we need to be able to find you on the street, okay? Like if I bump into you, I need I need to know it's you. Heck no, I'm gonna scare people away. No, my pick already up. Oh yeah, Jane. I mean San Juana. I see you girl. Oh, your voice is so beautiful. I was seeing your apron and I was like, is that her voice? You could totally be like the ones on the on the what what is that stupid phone? Play phone or pay? No. Hmm. Where people would like have phone sex and shit. What the fuck was it called? That stupid phone number? The hotline or something? I don't fucking remember what it was called. Was it called hotline? Party line. Andale, andale. La San Juana. She could be on naughty like. Hi, thank you for coming to my snails. Nah, just kidding. <laughs> yeah, that apron came out so cute. It did. I need one too. Me over here. Thank you for coming to my snails. I've posted before, but I don't take a lot of pics because I used to be obsessed with it. <laughs> I used to take all kinds of nail fees, selfies. Okay, let me open my cherries up. Let me throw them on my table. Alright, so this is what we're working with at the moment. Let me put my top coat. I'm going to put my top coat on the white. And I'm private. I don't think people care about the person behind the nails. They sure fucking do, Portia. They sure do. I don't want anyone finding me. That's true, huh? It's like, I'm trying to stay, stay private. All right, so now that the top coat is on, it's like the nail is like, ooh, extra white. Blended and perfect. No, just kidding, not perfect. I feel weird taking the pictures of myself. I prefer taking pictures of myself because some people be making me look fat, ugly, triple chin. They catch me when I'm blinking. It's like, bitch, I'm not ready. Like, honey. So it's like, I rather take my own photos. I will. I like being private. No one know me if I walk past them. Yeah, that's true. I feel like... The less people know about you, the better sometimes, you know? But not in our little nail community. We need to know each other. 
a few years ago, one of my clients told me, she's like, Zule, you put too much of your life out there. I'm like, damn, you're right. Because I would be on Snapchat, like, recording my whole fucking life and shit. So I stopped doing that. That's why when people be like, oh, show us this, show us that. I'm like, um, I don't know. Like, I'm showing you guys a little bit, a lot of it. I like to keep things private, too, but I share some things with you guys. Okay, okay, okay. Let me put tab coat real quick. And then we're going to put bling and cherries. We're going to put bling bling. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do to the index finger yet, but definitely that one's going to be my bling now. So if you guys ever think that your gel's streaky or anything like that, after like even your third coat, trust me, it just needs top coat and it will smoothen it out. Don't overthink it. After the third coat, you're doing too much. Or second coat. Even second coat. Ooh, honey, honey. Ice cream Porsche in my Kevin Hart voice. <laughs> they gotta see you as a client anyway. Yep, that top coat does wonders now i feel weird over here taking videos no parsha you take videos be a little conceited send me a voice video i mean yeah a video showing me your hair like hey zule check out my hair and my nails good night patrick and my cat if you have one, a kitty, cat, or a doggy, and show me your little ice cream that you're eating. Coming out so good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hard work paying off here. Damn, I cured this gel on my skin. I'm about to file it off. If anything, they're going to say, dang, you look different at home. For real. It's funny. I, I like seeing those videos of nail techs when they're all like dusty and shit. And then when they are like all dressed up on the gram and shit, it's like the book. That's probably how my clients be looking at my, my pictures. I mean, I don't really dress up, but when I be putting on makeup, like you do not look like that when you come to work. You look hella dusty and your hair sticking out and shit. I, I'm new here in New York. I'm loving your nail. Thank you. That's why I don't really like people picking up stuff. Because I be looking like a crazy lady. All my little money is going to go to your products. I love, love, love. No regrets. Yes, honey. It's an I was going to say it's an invention. What the fuck is wrong with my brush? Does it have cancer or something? So le está cayendo. I forgot what I was saying. Pinche brocha me distrayo. What are your favorite Zule products? All right. So all of them have gel except this one. I love your accent. Thank you. Oh, yes. Investment. It's an investment. A very smart investment. I appreciate everybody who... Trust me and invest in my products in my store or even just come to hang out with me. Give me the little likes, you know. Porque pues it's hard to gain people's trust, you know. But I promise to provide just quality. So did I show you guys this new color? No, huh? Or yeah, this one is the royal one who got this on their scoop. Who got a royal one under scoop. I'm fully invested. Yes, San Juana. Yes. Oh, you were asking me if she, if that other girl beat you, huh? In like your total order? I forgot to look. 
I need a dark green. Ooh, we have several, Carolina. But maybe I haven't put them on the website yet. Stay tuned as the fall as the fall approaches us. I'm gonna be dropping the dark colors little by little. So pretty. All right, let me just finish curing my nails. Zule, are you shipping to Australia in the future? Lady is asking. Um, I don't know what what the it's because some countries are a little bit more difficult to ship stuff to. So I have to check. Zule, I need your help on my brush. What happened, Giselle? What's the name of the dark green you have pinned? Me? Pinned? Where? Where do I have pinned? Oh, and, mm, girl, I don't remember. I had to go look. I think it's 130 something. I don't remember. I had to look. 138, I think, or something like that. Zule stealing merch again. Hell yeah, Paige. You know it. I actually found these little cherries in between the big pink ones. So I'm sorry, but I don't have any more pink baby ones. Any small cherries. These are the last ones. I do have the big ones in pink and in red. But not in baby form. So I'm going to put the babies on my nails. Do you have 3D brushes for sale? I want to learn 3D or is there a particular brush I can use? I do sell 3D brushes. I have number two through number six. Um, if I recommend to have all three if you can, but if you can't, start off with a number four or number two. Um, how do you do the cluster of diamonds on your left hand? I use the cluster gel. I'm going to be posting a video on it soon. I I recorded it. Okay, let me just cool them down before I touch anything. It's important for you guys not to touch shit while they're right out of the lamp because then they're going to get dull. Um, The scoops vary from bucket because I have different types of scoops. I place an order... Two days ago. Hold on. Um, if I place an order, can you package it all together? Um, as long as we haven't printed it, we can package it together. Okay, let me find my pink crystals because I had already taken out the the red ones. I was already ready look, to do red cherries. I was like, ooh, yes, but nope, we're going to do pink, so let me put this one back. I just plugged it in again. And I think I'm going to use um the... Golden, where are you, Golden Shadow? Golden Shadow, where are you? All right, I'm gonna use the pink ones and I'm gonna use the Golden Shadow, but those are hiding from me. Okay, okay. When my bling is like right in my face and I cannot find it. Just kidding, it wasn't in my face. Okay, let me put my cup over here before I drop my shit. Alright, so first I'm gonna put my cherries. 
I'm gonna be using I'm gonna be using Swarovski crystals today because these nails deserve it. All right, let's see where are we gonna put them. Are the gems on your website? Yes, we do have these on the website. They're under highest quality crystals. So on this nail, I'm going to put a few cherries. Ooh, it's not going to be so cute. It's going to be the full cherry nail. All right, I'm just going to scratch where the cherry... I don't know if I should put the cherries inside the box or... Let's see. Now I'm going to put it where they intersect. I don't fucking know, actually. I'm just going to scratch a few things. Now we can write more characters on here. Wow. What do you mean? So I'm just going to scratch a little bit just so that the glue can dry faster. I hate when the glue does not dry fast. I love it that it dries Okay, so I'm going to be using the labeling adhesive. If you never tried this, girl, you need to try it. I'm going to use both sizes, the big and the small. But I'm going to start out with the big one. So we're going to add enough glue. I'm going to make them turn a little bit. That's so cute. So normally when you apply decoration on top of, of gel, it takes forever to dry. I'm just going to throw some in the middle right here so it can get through the little crack of the cherries. Ooh, yes. Now you little bitch not going to fall off. So y'all need to secure your shit, all right? Don't think a drop of glue is going to do the work. You need to secure that little bitch. So not only did I put it on the base, but I also threw some in the little hole. So I could kind of like hold on to it better. Um, Let's see. I don't know. I want to be a little extra, extra. Read all about it. I'm going to put my little cherries. That one is turning that way, so this one's going to turn this way. It's like they're dangling in the air. Where to get the cherries? They are from my store link on bio i just don't have the little ones on the store anymore and those sold out like pancakes hot cakes when i just released when i just bought them a few months ago aren't they so cute hola Suley. Uy, uh, ya se están secando la verga. Yes, honey, they're looking cute. Will I be adding more to my nails? Girl. Okay, Um, do the crystals only come with a few? It depends which ones you're trying to get. If you're trying to get the good good, then yes, they only come with a few because they're expensive. Oh, to the store? No, I don't think I'm going to be adding it anymore. Because the fall is coming and nobody's going to be wearing cherries in the fall. So I'm going to add more cherries. I don't give a fuck if I'm having like a whole branch of cherries over here.
A ver, ¿qué andan diciendo estas perras? The chairs are literally on Shein in the UK. Well, you can find them wherever you find them. But right here, we didn't get them from Shein. Do they have them on Shein? Well, good for you, girl. Good for you. You can find them in a lot of places. But we sell them on my store for those who are interested. I think I'm going to add a little baby one here and then I'm going to bling. Bling, 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 bling. Hey, Vin. And I corrected you saying they ain't. <laughs> Fight, 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 fight. Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. Just kidding, just kidding. I'm gonna put this one more towards the corner. Así como bien, como que they're dancing down my nails. Do you sell the box, the pearl box in the bottom too? Um, I don't sell it made like that. I sell the pearls separate. I just threw them in my box. Yes, the glue holds them really good. I'm just going to go in right now and secure them a little bit more. This glue is good, good. But you have to do your, your, um, your... I guess you have to secure them yourself too. Like just not one little drop is not going to do the job. I like to put the glue in between the charms too. Like there's a little gap in here where the cherries are at. So that's where I'm putting the glue so it could seep through and could kind of hold it better. And then I'm going to spray the activator so that could dry quickly. And then... Um, the cherries are available on my website. Everything that I'm using is from my website. You guys can find it there. All right, and the crystals. And the crystals. Ooh, maybe I should do a little pearl. Pearl action. Where the fuck did my little stick go? Oh, there it is. Yeah, so I think I'm going to do some pink. Ooh, no, 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 no. Not on this nail. I'm going to do the golden shadow ones. Or the honey, whatever the hell they're called. Like, pew, 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 like little polka dots. I'm a Barbie girl. Back in the day when I was a beginner... I used to love doing these little crisscross shits and then put flowers. So instead of cherries, I would put flowers on them. That was like my, my, my thing. That's what they would call the Sinaloa style with the flowers and the, and the bling bling and the crisscross and the applesauce you know would love to see you with a matching set on both hands because i've never seen that before on you <laughs> ik16 you haven't been following me that long then girl because back in the day back in the day before covid I me las hacía. but i haven't done that in a good minute because oh shit this one is smaller because i do it for content this is my job to create content, and if I have them all the same, then you guys are not seeing different, different, you know? And that way I can come on live different times, different times. Y luego aparte de que it takes me so motherfucking long to do my nails, imagine doing both hands the same day, no manches. I had to literally not do anything but my nails. And I get tired just doing one hand. Just one hand. Like, I neglect my family enough with one hand. Does it show on top of gel when it's cured, the glue? Um, if you put a lot, yes. But I normally like to put the glue first and then 
the top coat so that it kind of camouflages the glue. That looks so cute already. Oh my gosh. Look at it. No, these are not gel eggs. These are acrylics. I think I'm gonna put the little the little um cherry on this one right here only because I fucked up my French a little bit. Or should I put it here? I'll put the baby one and then I'll put another one. That's too many cherries already, huh? Zule, are you taking appointments? Um, I'm taking appointments for September soon. Oh, so many places I could put the cherries. I think I'm gonna put a little baby one down here, like in the little corner. Even though I messed up my French, I guess we can show it off. I'll see you inside way. Every nail must have a cherry. And I'm spraying activator to speed up the dry time. Can't really tell it's messed up. Or maybe I could tell because I know I didn't clean it good. I didn't clean it very good. It really looks cute like that, huh? Without no more cherries. But eh, hey, just kidding. Um, Let's see. Let me add some bling. Maybe that's enough cherries for the set. Let's add some bling, 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 bling. I'm gonna add it to this now. Mm. I don't have a lot of pink, pink bling. Freak where are you located? I am in, well, I'm in California. I do nails in Los Angeles, but I live, I live in the desert. I was going to do Crystal AB um color but the cherries have like a little rose gold on them so i was like mm, i'm gonna do golden golden so i don't have a lot of um shapes of pink so i'm just gonna do the little this one right here i have to be quiet now because my son's room my son's room is above mine so i can't yell he needs to go to sleep Is this a permanent set? Not pop up. Well, it's a permanent set, but it's not going to be that permanent. I'm going to probably take it off in two days. Because, you know, we need more bling bling. More nail ideas. It's just for content. All my clients are really simple lately, so I haven't been posting their nails. So I got to make up. I oh, mean, I have to make up for those posts. I'm not putting so cute. It's like you could be classy and bling all in one. All in one. Um, you can find the crystals on my website. They are under the highest quality crystals. Or you could also buy them at blue streaks. Bluestreaks.com. I think that's her profile. I don't fucking know. 
me la puse media chuex, pero es ok. Tengo el dedo chuex, no importa, no importa, mija. I took the same from Shein, they are perfect. Hmm? The crystals. They do not sell these crystals on Shein, my friend. These are Swarovski. Swarovski. Dice mi cría que te manda hearts because she loves your nails. Ah, oh, how cute. I took my practical today and hopefully... Oh, shit. Probably Blue Street Crystals. Yeah. I don't know if it's .com or .net or what. But I know they sell them too. I feel like it needs a little bit more. It needs a little bit more. No, I'm just kidding. I ain't gonna put a cherry there. Just kidding. Come on, little cherry. Come on, little cherry. I want to put more, but I'm not sure if I should. Or maybe I should put like a little line of gel, like a little golden one would look cute. Jackie, what state was your practice? I thought we couldn't buy Swarovski no more. Um, well, they sell them. Their crystals are another brand, but they're literally the same. Outline the French tip with crystals. With crystals, crystals. I always, I always, um, I always cover up all my fucking. Maybe I should add a white to this one, huh? Like a little outline? No, 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 no. Bling, 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 bling. I'm just gonna add a bling. Fuck it. Fuck it. Look like. Add more bling. I know. Add more. Add more. Just a little bit more. I'm not going to put any flowers on this set today. Así nomás con el bling bling. Flowers is coming up a different day. Otro día vamos a hacer las flowers. Mm. A ver, ¿qué le ponemos a las pinches uñas? Un marquís. Un marquís. Drop below to the flow. Fucking bitch. Where are you going? Where are you going, you bitch? Hold on, guys. My bling bling is being a rebel. No, hombre. I guess Marquise doesn't want to come. It does not want to come. Bad bitch, you come in onto the nail whether you like it or not. Oh, you know what? I could add a little flame, a little gold one. Since I have a big one, I could put a small one. I could do a small one. I think I'm gonna start selling some of my Swarovski. Because my clients have not been wearing it. So it's like, pa que necesito tanto. I'll share with y'all bitches. Zoo. It's not hating. Just not everyone can afford expensive gems. So there are cheap alternatives. There are definitely cheaper alternatives. You get what you pay for. We are not here for the cheap, cheap. We like the expensive. The cheap crystals do not shine like Swarovski crystals, so. 
I'm not sure what they're talking about, but girl, we only like the high quality shit here. Shorty, you do realize it's kind of rude to come on her life. What are they saying? Now I want to go look. Let's see. who, What they saying? What they saying? Um, are you guys fighting somebody? I don't know what's going on, but... Oh, they keep talking about Shein. Oh, you guys could let them talk on, about Shein. Who cares? They could go shop on Shein if they want to. The Shein workers are here. They probably do work there, huh? Like, let's go promote on nail tech pages. Be careful of cheap nail products. It goes on your skin. High quality is always safer. Or what is it? Yeah. I mean, if you guys are going to practice, fuck it. I mean, when, you, when you're a beginner, get whatever you can afford. Shit. But know that not if, it's a hit and miss sometimes. You know, there's certain things you, you should buy from Shein. Like, I bought my dog a sweater. It's cute and everything, but it ain't the best quality. And I knew that, you know? I knew that when I ordered it. Just it was so cute. It was so cute. But I was like, not going to do that again. But definitely keep that in mind. Like, would you like it if somebody comes to your nail page or salon and be like, Oh, Tammy does it cheaper. You could get your nails done with Tammy for cheaper. And you're like, bitch. Get the fuck out of here. Nobody cares about Tammy. Nah, it's kidding. <laughs> so that's how you, she and ladies are sounding. Like, yes, it is cheaper somewhere else sometimes. But that's not the point. That's not the point. The point is that she and don't fucking show you how to wear the shit, okay? Zule does. So you can go shop at Shein and ask them to show you how to use their products. Are you gonna put top coat again? No, no more top coat. How y'all hating and tell people to go to Shein when she has her products? Mm-hmm. Es que es, nomás quieren que no me compren. No quieren que me compren. Pero no saben que mis hoes son loyo. Can we talk about your glue? Of course, we can just change the subject. Most of us know Zule's quality. Mm -hmm. Somebody was saying that my crystals were from Walmart last time. <laughs> it was funny as I know you get what you pay for. I love your nails. It's talent. I wasn't hating on anyone. Okay, okay. All right, let me just spray this bitch porque se me sigue moviendo la verga. Damn, not Walmart. Yeah, last time, I forgot what I was doing. I think I was doing the scoops or something. And they're like, they're from Walmart. Like, girl, bye. Um, I'm a teen who is in college for nails. It's a struggle. Yes, when you are in college, it definitely is a struggle. I'm so sorry, but that was funny. No, yeah, people are hilarious. All right, we're about to add a little bit more bling on this pinky. Because looking a little sad. I do want to put bling on the French. I was even considering blinging out a whole French. But I told myself that when I do a French... Um... I always cover it up, so I don't want to do that today. 
I don't want to cover them. I want to just keep them kind of simple and clean. I mean, they're not that simple. Look at all my cherries. I should probably just put another cherry on that one, huh? I'm just going to do it here. It's like a cherry festival. Oh my god, my son was... What? What was he doing? Fainting? Farting? If you do your nails game, is fire cheap or expensive? Hmm? You could get your nails done with um at a low cost and make them look expensive. But you have to know what to buy. It's kind of like when you dress up, um, you can buy cheap clothes and dress it up with something else. Or you could just be all expensive. It's up to you. You know, like you can buy raw stuff and still look cute. But it's not going to last a long time. It's like a one-time use and then you start to get fuzzies or rips when you bend down or whatever, you know? I'm just going to leave it like that. Balling on a budget. Mm -hmm. So it's cool. You could, you could do that, but no, that's not going to last forever. That's what I'm trying to teach my son because last time we went to the Nike store and he was like looking at me like I'm stupid or something for trying to buy like a 60 cookie dollar workout shirt, right? And I was explaining to him that I like I like Walmart ones too. Like I buy a lot of Walmart shirts. Literally that's all I wear, Walmart or Target. Mostly Walmart, you know? Because they have cute shit. They have cute shit at a good price, right? But the quality ain't there at Walmart. So I'm going to be having those little fuzzballs real quick. And with the Nike, Nike apparel, you can wear it for years. Wash it as many times and they always going to be, um, it's going to look new and good. And that's why I like their workout stuff. Not that I work out or anything like that, but... <laughs> I still like it. I feel like that one needs a little bit of white. No, 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 no. It's going to be by itself, Lule. It's going to be by itself. As a matter of fact, I think I'm going to put some of my sparkly top coat. Just to make it look a little safe, right? So, yeah. I was telling him last night not always cheap is good. But... When there's no other choice, fuck it. Since I have gold going on, I have decided I'm going to do my sparkle top coat. Because it has a little gold shimmer. Thanks to whoever reminded me I have this top coat. Because I had it in my desk over there. So this is a shiny top coat, but it has glitter. So if you guys like the flitter, you could spice up a nail real quick just with the top coat. And it's a no wipe. So let me just put let me just put some top coat some top coat up in here up in here how do you know if a top coat is a no wipe or not normally it says says or if it's like when you put in the lamp um how to call it if it stays sticky that means it's a wipe you have to wipe it with alcohol and a no wipe just means that once it comes out of the lamp it's ready to go you don't have to remove any tacky nothing 
Oh, wait, this one doesn't say no wipe. But I think on the website I put it. So check it out. The little shimmer is like there. It's subtle, but it's there. Oh my God, now I wish I should have put it on another nail. And this one would look cute. All right, let me cure that. beautiful out of habit i still wipe that no wipe <laughs> no girl don't wipe it you're gonna make it dull i have i've never liked the no wipe ones i mean the wipe ones never ever ever i remember a long time ago i didn't know really about gel so i see the hammy clienta with the stickiness and she's like, it's not dry yet. Do you usually have two different designs on each hand? Yes, I always, for the most part, have two different designs. Hmm. I do it for content because I like to show you guys all the products that I have, how to use them, give you guys ideas, and for like my content on Instagram. They look so fucking cute. I low-key do like them. Wait till I show you guys with my rings. Let me prepare my cuticle oil. I'm going to take off the X's. I want a piña, piña colada. What you guys get blocked for? What? I'm a nail tech too, but I'm not able to f to fix my right hand, just the left. It takes practice, 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 practice. Just do it. Even if they come out lumpy and ugly and shit, do it. The more you do it, the the easier it'll get. But it is really frustrating in the beginning, not gonna lie. I'm new to the account. I just, I joined from For You page. Okay. Only positive vibes here, please. It's cool. I always catch it on her YouTube. I'm buying the Mylar. Hmm? Hmm. I'm buying the Mylar. I need you to show me how to use it. Um, Which Mylar are you buying? The mermaid flakes or the colorful ones or the fall ones this is the the simplest you see me do mm, i think i've done more simple no i feel like this hand is more simple than this one maybe not maybe not Do Larry posting this set you did a few days ago on your practice hand? Um, which one? I try to post them all. I'm a little late, but I post. I post. All right, let me put my fingers. I mean, my rings. I bought these rings so I could look like a gangster. I don't even know how to put rings on, but bitch, I'm just going to be like everybody on Instagram with a million rings. Like, look, two hearts, two for one. All right, hold on. If only had a cherry one, that would be cute. Even if they don't match, fuck it. We just need rings up in here. <laughs> I need a butterfly one. 
I mean a cherry ring. This one, the heart ring, you like that one? They are from Yia Accessories. I tagged her on my Instagram. They came out gorgeous. Honey, let me show you guys up close. The only thing about having rings is that I can't close my fingers. Look at that little shimmer. Look, you guys could see where I fucked up my fringe right there, right there, right there, right there. Like, I fucked it up because no le limpie bien. But other than that, came out good, huh? Proud of myself. Proud of myself. All right, guys. Well, thank you guys for hanging out with me. Ahora sí, es hora de las nelfies. Y a dormir. Porque mañana es martes y tenemos que ir a trabajar. Pues yo no, a lo mejor ustedes, pero yo no. The one with the unicorn glitter and salmon cover, I think it had butterflies. Stunning. Good night, Lily. Which number cover pink? This pink is called Luscious. This one. Luscious pink. It's part of my new cover acrylics. Sleep good. Yeah, good night, everyone. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. I'll see you guys tomorrow in the Instagram. Así para que me den like, okay? And don't forget to go show me some love. Show me some love. So gorgeous, huh? These are crazy beautiful. I'm probably out of my league. Girl, these are definitely not my style, but we senora vibes today, huh? All right, good night, everyone. Sweet dreams. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for blocking these hoes up in here. <laughs> Let me show you guys both of my nails. My nails so big, they don't fit on the screen. Which one's your favorite? Team French or Team Blue and Purple? La marca es, es mi marca, amiga. Puedes ir al, a mi perfil. Ahí está el enlace para la página. The French. Las dos. No, no puedes escoger las dos. Tienes que decir una. ¿Tú cuál te harías? ¿La blanca? Oh, la pink. Pole. Okay, let's do a last poll before we go to sleep. Team French is going to be the happy face. Team blue purple is the crying face. So you can vote here. Which one is your favorite? This one's for French. This one's for the blue purple. Damn, everybody be liking the French. I'm going to go change my pedicure to French and I'm going to put a cherry on my toe. No, 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 el coco, no, el coco, no. No te me subas al coco, no. No, 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 el coco, no, el coco, no. Eh, just kidding. Definitely French wins. I swear if these nails don't get like a million likes. I'm about to slap a bitch. And just kidding. So definitely French wins. So gorgeous. So gorgeous. All right. Ahora sí a dormir de veras. Good night, amigas. See you guys. Maybe on Tuesday. Oh, not tomorrow's Tuesday. Maybe on Wednesday. Bye. Una noche más. Y copas de más, tú no me dejas en paz, de mi mente no te...